increases warps duration to 10 seconds so i could probably throw somebody while they're laying down i warp them drain their shields as they're standing up i light them up with a pistol or a shotgun watch how i play this one so so watch how i play this one bro y'all gonna be like wow he really do this now watch this i walk in no 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 You obviously don't know that you're about to die. Ah. I'm dead, bro. And your turn, bro. I'm gonna dance on your grave, he says. Everybody dying. <laughs> oh my gosh, bro. That game is brutal. I just hate the feeling of picking out a new game, thinking that you're gonna have a great time, and then it turns out to be that. You know, that's how I'm feeling right now. It's like, it's like, damn, the game really beat me. But it's not like that game is ever talked about. Like it's like a classic like that. But you just, you know, it's a classic if they got four Fallout Four in this big ass game. Like you know, there's something there, bro. But uh, but low key, low key, I've been wanting to play this too. I've been wanting to play this too, bro. I think this could be kind of cool, y'all. You know, you know, hey, bro. Fallout, enjoy it, bro. We tried, bro. All right, the original Mass Effect, bro. Here we go. Gurren J, he gonna get somebody killed off gate. Y'all gonna stop shaming me for my decision-based gaming decisions when i really haven't gotten that many people killed killed it's been all in one game bro get off my bumper welcome to alliance military database thank you classified information requested i'm about to mute establishing secure connection you didn't even tell me i'm gonna let him listen Secure connection confirmed okay make sure nobody see my ip y'all Due to your covert N7 status, ID records are incomplete. Please confirm identity from the records below or register manually. Bro, I'm not finna be no shepherd, bro. Please log in to access your profile. I could, I, bro. I was gonna make it Edmund Chef. Warning, data corruption detected. Please reconstruct profile. What are you talking about? Confirm pre-service history. Hold on. Okay, so a spacer is both of your parents were in the Alliance military. Hold on. Your childhood was spent on ships, stations as they transferred from posting to posting, never staying in one location for more than a few years. Following in your parents' footsteps, you enlisted at the age of 18. Hey, bro. The streets are saying that you're giving up on Fallout, man. Fallout blows, bro. That game is for fucking fathers, bro. <laughs> I'm cool, bro. What? Like, what blows about it? Like, what happened? I w yeah, you know what's crazy is I would love to see you try to play it, bro. But basically, it's the most mm -hmm. unforgiving game on the planet. They give you nothing. The builds, really, you probably only got one build that would get you through the beginning. Uh, mm -hmm. Everything is super expensive. You say one thing, you die. You say the other thing, you're blocked out of a mission. You say the other thing, nothing happens. And then you're running around wondering where the fuck is the water chip? That game <laughs> sucks, bro. That so game like, what you on now? Like, what you finna do now? Bro, I'm playing some Mass Effect, bro. Okay. What you doing? I'm, I'm just playing, a, you know, some Uncharted. Bro, Still. Fallout really got me <laughs> up, bro. <laughs> it, was, it was really that bad? That game sucks, bro. Bro, I was. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I missed it. It was some I mean, real cornball shit. Mass Effect? Yes. That was gotta be fired in. We're hoping so. We're hoping so, bro. But hey, bro, I, I just, I just wanted to make sure you know that you weren't giving up prematurely. But it sounds like, it sounds like you've had enough. You think I'm just a? You think I'm like a like a preemie gamer or something, bro? No, 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 no. I was sitting here in my saying. <laughs> 
hey, if I know Berlin, he's gonna conquer that game. And then, and, and he like, bro, real shit. I was sitting there like, he's gonna sit there and conquer it because he a gamer. And this is where my chat goes, he already switched. I was like, what? He switched. And so I just, I was like, ain't no way. So Who I went over there and like, bro, why are y'all like running through the metaverse streets, bro? <laughs> Hey, like, bro, sit still and let's play this for a minute first. Bro, bro, someone really came over and was like, hey, man, I don't know if he's going to fit his balls out. I was like, no, nah, he got it, bro. He got it. And oh, then, my and God. Out, he mad as fuck. You know, that's why I called, bro. I just wanted to try to use some words of encouragement. And then, you know. Thank you, bro. Uh, hey, of course, bro. My fault, bro. I'm, hey. I'm, I'm, I'm going to just enjoy this Mass Effect. Hell yeah, bro. Enjoy yourself. My fault for interrupting. All right, bro. You were born and raised on Mindor, a small border colony in the attacking Traverse. When you were 16, slavers raided Mindor, slaughtering your family and friends. You were saved by a passing alliance patrol, and you enlisted with the military a few years later. Hell no. Nah. You were an orphan raised on the streets of the great megatropolis's covering earth. You escaped a life of petty crime and underworld gains by enlisting with the Alliance military when you turned 18. I was pushing P. Confirmed I like this. Psychological profile. What was this? What was the previous Confirm one? pre-service history. History, got it. All right. Confirm psychological profile. So this is this is all after 18. I don't think I need to read these. It's just like, you know, what kind of person am I going to be? Kind of like Soul Confirm Survivor, bro. military specialization. A soldier, combat specialist, ideal for the front lines, okay? Tech specialist, using holographic omni tool that can decrypt security systems, repair, okay, mm, okay. Biotech specialist, okay, through upgradable implants, they can use biotech powers to lift, okay. This seems kind of cool. Infiltrator. So adept is so a sentinel is just an adept and an infiltrator put together. Bro, bro, why wouldn't I want that? They combine biotics and weapons to take down. This seems fire. This seems fire. I'm here. Confirm I'm here with it. Facial identification. Hold on. Let me Confirm make sure I know what this is. Military specialization. Vanguards are biotic warriors. They combine biotics and weapons to take down opponents and are especially deadly. Yeah, I Confirm like that a lot, bro. Facial identification. No, 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 no. We got to change this up, bro. First things first, bro. Excuse me, excuse me. Um, excuse me. Excuse me. Skin, 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 please. Skin, please. Excuse me. Skin. Profile reconstruction. Absolutely not, bro. Facial identification. Here we go. Bro, what the hell is all this right here? Like, what is this? We go something right there. This is ridiculous, bro. Where the fro at? Where's the fro, please? <laughs> okay, this will work. The John Von Strangle, is that what y'all calling me? Really, bro? Jorgen Von Strangle? Come on now. Put some respect on my sh bro. Say what you want, bro. Say what you want, bro. I'm looking kind of cool, bro. I'm looking kind of cool, bro. The brow's crazy, bro. They don't have anything less than this. They don't have anything less, bro. It's gotta be this, bro. There you go. There you go. <laughs> we gotta get a fire scar going. That shit clean as a bitch. Hold on. I didn't see the other side. Hold on. I gotta get something that looked like I was attacked by a wild bison. Nothing else looks as cool. Man, f it. Profile reconstruction complete. You look kind of cool. Identification confirmed. 
Veteran. Veteran. Of course, veteran. Well, what about Shepard? Earthborn, but no record of his family. Doesn't have one. He was raised on the streets. Learned to look out for himself. He saw his whole unit die on a cruise. He could have some serious emotional scars. Every soldier has scars. Shepard's a survivor. Is that the kind of person we want protecting the galaxy? That's the only kind of person who can protect the galaxy. Talk to him. I'll make the call. I know it's not Key David again, bro. In the year 2148, explorers on Mars discovered the remains of an ancient sparse, space-faring civilization. In the decades that followed, these mysterious artifacts revealed startling new technologies, enabling travel to the furthest stars. The basis for this incredible technology was a... Commander of this, ah. bro. Respect me, my man. Put some respect on my name. <laughs> Calculating transit mass and destination. You see how he got his back, res your back got respect because it's a wreck? All stations secure for transit. Let's go. Get out my way, young man. Big boy. Ah. For big boys only. <laughs> okay okay he got a fat old ass yo somebody banned by funeral for me no take backs either you let him breathe you can let him breathe Thrusters, check. Navigation. Oh, uh, PG. Internal emission sync engaged. All systems online. Drift, just under 1500K. 1500 is good. Your captain will be pleased. I hate that guy. Nihilus gave you a compliment. You flying with a shrimp on, on, the, on, the, on the ship? You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Call me paranoid. You're paranoid. The council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. But only an idiot believes the official story. What are we talking about, bro? Only idiots believe the official story. This felt important. Not even gonna lie to y'all, bro. I'm starting off on the wrong foot. I'm about to make the whole character over again. Just so I can hear that opening cutscene, bro. I don't know what's going on. Some about dude don't look confirm, right. Some about confirm, dude. Nah, 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 nah. Get me, so get me out of here. Get me out of here. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just have to figure it out, bro. Profile. I don't like this guy. We just gonna have to. We just got to figure it out. I'm telling you, I just saw him. He marched by like he was on a mission. He's a specter. They're always on a mission. And we're getting dragged right along with him. Relax, Presley. You're gonna give yourself an. Why, why am I doing this? Hold right mouse button and move. Okay. Yep. On a power I icon to use dog. it. It's not the kind of place Spectres visit. There's something Nihilus isn't telling us about this mission. That's crazy. It's not the letting me. In charge here. He wouldn't take orders from a Spectre. Not his choice, Doc. Spectre. They can do whatever they want. Kill anyone who gets in their way. <laughs> you watch too many spy vids, Jenkins. It's not letting me talk to anybody.
Space bar. Commander Shepard, I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. Then where's Captain Anderson? The captain said he'd meet me here. He's on his way. I'm interested in this world we're going to. Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. You look like a shrimp, bro. I've never been there. But you know of it. It's become something of a symbol for your people, hasn't it? Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it, really? If you've got something to say, just say it. Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. You mean by you is people? Is the Alliance truly ready for this? I think it's about time we told the Commander what's really going on. This mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. I figured there was something you weren't telling us. We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. There must be a reason you didn't tell me about this, sir. This comes down from the top, Commander. Information strictly on a need-to-know basis. A research team on Eden Prime was Prothean. Dylan, please, please. Don't, don't, don't restart this eyebrow combo, please. We, we just settled down. A research team on Eden Prime unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. It was... I thought the Protheans vanished 50,000 years ago. Their legacy still remains. <laughs> the mass relays, the citadel, our ship drives. Our it's all resume. based on Prothean technology. This is big, Shepard. The last time humanity made a discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward 200 years. But Eden Prime doesn't have the facilities to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the citadel for proper study. Obviously, this goes beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. Why did we tell the Council? Why didn't we keep the beacon for ourselves? You humans don't have the best reputation. Some species see you as selfish, too unpredictable, too independent, even dangerous. Sharing that beacon will improve relations with the Council. Plus, we need their scientific expertise. They know more about the Protheans than we do. The beacon's not the only reason I'm here, Shepard. Nihilus wants to see you in action, Commander. He's here to evaluate you. What the f***, bro? When do I get my evaluation of Nihilus, bro? I wish we had like a lore, like a backstory. Like, are, are the Earthlings the last people to join the council? Like the aliens have been on the council and the Earthlings just joined in? It's like, bro, like hell he Since is. when do we answer to the Spectres? Ooh, ooh, ooh. You're smart enough to know how things work, Commander. The Alliance has been pushing for this for a long time. The Alliance. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. We want more say with the Citadel Council. The Spectres represent the council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. They aren't part of the Not galactic government. Okay, okay. You showed a remarkable will to live. A particularly useful talent. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate oh, for this the This is fire! Let me go ahead and stand up for a sec. Uh, you put my name forward. You support this? Yeah, let's talk, let's talk about this. Why would a Turian want a human in the Spectres? Not all Turians resent humanity. Some of us see the potential of your species. We see what you have to offer to the rest of the galaxy, and to the Spectres. We are an elite group. It's rare to find an individual with the skills we see. Ending racism, I W. We love it. Human Shepherd. I only care that you can do the job. Okay, Nihilus. Nihilus cool in my book. Nihilus cool in my book. Very level-headed um, shrimp. What if I refuse? I don't like people making decisions about my future. This isn't about you, Shepard. Humanity needs this. We're counting on you. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. You'll be in charge of the ground team. Secure the beacon and get it onto the ship ASAP. Nihilus will accompany you to observe the mission. Yeah, tell me more about Eden Prime. Something tells me Eden Prime's gonna be like, bro, you're not taking our, our beacon. My face, Jamie Foxx. I'd like to know more about Eden Prime before we touch down. It's a peaceful farming world. Major pain? But it represents something much bigger. Eden Prime is one of our oldest and most successful colonies. It proved we were ready to face the challenges of settling new worlds, to forge a place for humanity beyond Earth. It symbolizes humanity's growth and evolution as a spacefaring species. And after this, 
it will be known as the world where humans made a discovery of galactic importance. Mm. The beacon. Why is this beacon so important? All advanced galactic civilization is based on Prothean technology, even yours. If we hadn't discovered those Prothean ruins buried on Mars, we'd still be stuck on Earth. That was just a small data cache. Who knows what we can learn from this beacon? What if it's a weapons archive? We can't let it fall into the wrong hands. Wrong hands? I thought we was all in a council together, working together, sir. Like who? The Attican Traverse isn't the most stable sector of Citadel space. There are plenty of raiders and criminal groups active in the region. They might figure a Prothean beacon is worth the risk of attacking an Alliant ship. Plus, Eden Prime is right on the border of the Terminus systems. Terminus systems, sir? The Attican Traverse is under Citadel protection. If the Terminus systems attack, it's an act of war. Technically, yes. But some of the species in the Terminus might be willing to start a war over this. The last thing the Council wants is to get dragged into a major conflict with the Terminus systems. We have to keep this low key. Okay. I, th I think that's everything, right? It's pretty cool. Just give the word, Captain. We should be getting close to Eden. Captain, we got a problem. What's wrong, Joker? Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. Oh, God. Bring it up on screen. Oh, that, throw that ass in the circle said, eyebrow said, well, I'm done here, bro. Get down! <laughs> He's like, bro, this where we going? Are you we sure? Are attack, taking heavy casualties. I repeat, heavy casualties. We can't. He having, he having PTSD flashbacks we right now. Damn. What are we looking at? What? Everything cuts out after that. No calm traffic at all. It just goes dead. No wonder Shrimp got me here, bro, because there's hella squids in the sky. It's a race war. Status report. 17 minutes out, Captain. No other Alliance ships in the area. Oh, Take nah, bro. Fast and quiet. This mission just got a lot more complicated. Bro, you a knew. small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. It's our best chance to secure the beacon. Grab your gear and meet us in the cargo hold. Tell Elenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. Master Gaging stealth systems. You look nasty up close. Bro. Somebody was doing some serious digging here, Captain. Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. Absolutely, what sir. What about survivors, Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary objective. The beacon's your top priority. Approaching drop point one. Nihilus, you coming with us? I move faster on my own. Can I, can I pause this? I'm not even going to push this game. You status reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. Can we trust bro, sir? Sir, why does he already know where to go, sir? We don't, bro. I don't like putting my life in the hands of a Turian, sir. Nihilus is on our side. It's a little racist. He wants you in the spectrums, and he wants that beat. It's a little specious. It's specious. I can pause. Now, you, escape doesn't do anything, y'all. Nihilus is on our side. He wants you in the Spectres, and he wants the beacon. Understood, Captain. Ready and able, sir. The mission's yours now, Shepard. Good luck. I don't trust, bro. We are approaching drop point two. Edmund Shepard's not a racist. He's more specious, bro. And he's, uh... Ship perimeters. That ain't right. It ain't right. Ain't no excuse for that. Maybe his character development, you know over time, you know. Give him a chance, y'all. What am I trying to do right now? Oh yeah. Let's scale that back a little bit. Hold left mouse button to fire. Sustained fire causes hot, weapons man. to overheat. Hostiles everywhere. What the hell are those? Gas tanks. Don't worry, they're harmless. Whoops. Oh, God. What happened here? Oh, 
left shift to switch weapons for your squad. So these are my four. These are their four. These are their moves, I guess. This is mine. Damages all nearby enemies and objects and makes them more vulnerable to further damage. I played this back in the day. It's just been a while, bro. Allows you to throw enemies and objects. Okay. Oh, I did not play that in drama. I think I, I think I played three. I think I played three. I never played this one. I could be wrong with that too, though. Silly boy Glizzy, thank you for the tier one. Why would Jenkins run out there and? Oh, I don't want this. You go get there you go he's really dead rip right through his shields we're at a chance he deserves a burial we'll see that he receives a proper service once the mission is complete but i need you to stay focused aye aye sir Bro, my shot is there. I don't know what you're talking about. Still shooting garbage, bro. I don't know what gameplay you watching. I'm doing my thing, bro. I'm nice, bro. How come there was never a Mass Effect multiplayer? Medi gel is needed to heal injured squad members. Omni gel can be used to bypass the description. They're telling me this as I'm getting shot at. I've got some burned out buildings here, Shepard. A lot of bodies. I'm gonna check it out. I'll try to catch up with you at the dig site. Press Q or E to send the squad mate ahead. Proceed to call them back. Go Caden. Go Caden. Go Caden. No, no, no. I said, I said, go up there, Caden. Caden, further, Caden. Caden. Listen to what I'm telling you to do now. Go, go over there, sir. The shot was there, the gun was not. Okay, okay. All right, say less. Let me get the Lancer out. I'm here for the beacon. She was the one on the on the on the radio call. She nice with it. She nice. She nice. She nice. Oh, we finna get tough. Mmm. 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 Robots, of course. It's always robots. Nah, that that mother got. Uh, I don't know, something with the shrimp dude, bro, because they all look like reptiles a little. This gun blows. Let's talk to Ashley Williams. You wanna... Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one in charge here, sir? So you can't talk during fights. You gotta wait for them to win. Are you all right? Are you wounded, Williams? A few scrapes and burns, nothing serious. The others weren't so lucky. Oh man, we were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. Um, what happened to the rest of your unit, girl? She's smooth. She she is smooth. She is smooth, bro. She's she's very very smooth, bro. You know, we gotta. I want to keep it PG. She is so smooth. Where's the rest of your squad? We tried to double back to the beacon, God damn, but she's we walked smooth. into an ambush. I don't think any of the others... I think I'm the only one left. I've been there. I've been there. It's all Survivor. I've been there, too. Yep. 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 One thing I know is you, you will need a shoulder to cry on, and... I got two, so... Keep me in mind. You can tell her you abandoned... <laughs> this game is crazy. This isn't your fault, Williams. You couldn't have done anything to save them. Yes, sir. 
We held our position as long as we could, until the Geth overwhelmed us. The Geth haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. Why are they here now? They must have come for the beacon. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. Um... Join us, join us. You're part of our crew now. We could use your help, Williams. Aye, aye, sir. It's time for payback. Oh! Okay. Before the attack, talk Describe to me. Describe what happened leading up to the attack. We were sent out a couple of nights ago from the main colony to Gee, secure the area. Seemed like a routine patrol until the Geth hit us. We never knew they were coming. What happened to the researchers at the dig site? I don't know. They set up camp near the beacon. The 232 was with them. Maybe their unit fared better than mine. Um, Geth. Talk to me about Geth. What else do you know about the Geth? Just what I remember from history class back in school. They're synthetics, non-organic life forms with limited AI programming, created by the Quarians a few centuries ago. They were supposed to be a source of cheap labor, but ended up turning on the Quarians and drove them into exile. Well, after that, they just kind of disappeared behind the Perseus Veil. Nobody's really heard much from them since. Nihilus, right? Where is where's Bro at? Have you seen a Turian Spectre around here? There aren't any Turians on Eden Prime. None that I've ever met. Not sure I'd be able to tell if one was a Spectre anyway. If you saw this guy, you'd know. Carries enough firepower to wipe out a whole platoon. Luckily, he's on our side. What are you shooting, Sorry. bro? Did you see his like hand? I said, no Turians. Oh my gosh. Bro shooting. I don't even know the molecule for oxygen, bro. But I was, whatever it is, bombs. CO2? Bro, 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 bro. I didn't go to school for that, bro. Tell me everything you know about the beacon. O2? Okay. They were doing some digging out here to extend the monorail and expand the colony. A few weeks ago, they unearthed some Prothean ruins and the beacon. Suddenly, every scientific expert in the colony was interested. That's when they brought us in to secure the You are site. worthless, bro. I don't know much about the beacon itself, but I heard one of the researchers say this could be the biggest scientific discovery of the century. Move out. Let's go, squad. Nah, I need, I press escape to go to the squad screen to spend talent points for new squad members. The squad screen lets you view your team's talents. Mouse over a talent or its rank to view it. Click on a talent to spend a talent point to gain a rank in it. As you gain levels, you will acquire talent points and unlock higher ranks. Okay, so I have three points to spend. Is that on everybody? Oh, we each got our own. That is fire. Okay, so she's got one in combat armor, one in assault training. What about one in romance? Can I can I boost? I'm gonna chill. Uh, let's see here. I'm gonna do. Uh, it's not a skill point for um, understanding commands, so I'm just gonna I'm gonna save those two points until I realize what they can actually use. What about you, Caden? I want to take your two points away and watch you disintegrate, bro. You're worthless to me. Let's see. Let's see. Um, it throws enemy away from the caster with a force of 600 newtons. What does that mean? What does that mean, bro? Barrier. Bolsters your shield with a biotic barrier. That's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. Will not block attacks that bypass shields. And what? It's the point of a shield. Does anybody have first aid here? Do I? You know, you're first aiding. Restore 40 healths for all wounded? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Matter of fact, boost that twice. Yep, yep. Because you clearly can't fight, bro. Like, release he's hating on Kaiden, but I can't even be mad. Bro, we're, we're, th this isn't what we're going to do. We're not going to get in here and be like, Oh, Berlizzi, I wouldn't be mad at him. Berlizzi, Berlizzi, flirt with her instead. She's better. Like, bro, let me play me, bro. My character said that they're good with close range weapons. I'm going to do one in pistols. Increase biotic protection by six. Increase pistol and shotgun damage for sure. I'm going to set my, uh, yep, yep, yep. Charm. It opens up new dialogue for sure. And then Ashley will come back here. Um... Increases weapon damage. I'm gonna give her one. Oh, these little blips are powers. Okay. Allows long bursts of assault rifle fire without overheating. Oh, that's 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 critical. And then we'll do um soldier. 
We're out of here. You're in charge. <laughs> you are in charge of the ground team dropped on Tedum Prime, an alliance colony under attack. Your primary goal is to find and secure the Prothean Beacon. The Prothean Beacon. <laughs> Jenkins is dead, but you have to press on to the dig site. Bro, when I play games like this, I hate seeing flashing icons. See, this, this is this is how we. Twelve hundred years ago, the Turians were invited to join the Citadel Council to fulfill the role of galactic peacekeepers. The Turians have the largest fleet in Citadel space and they make up the single largest portion of the Council's military forces. Damn. As their territory and influence has spread, the Turians have come to rely on the Salarians for military intelligence and the Asari for diplomacy. Despite a somewhat colonial attitude towards the rest of the galaxy, the ruling hierarchy understands they would lose more than they would gain if the other two races were ever removed. Turians come from an autocratic society that values discipline and possesses a strong sense of personal and collective honor. There is lingering animosity between Turians and humans over the first contact war of 2157, mm. which is known as the Relay 314 incident to the Turians. Officially, however, the two species are allies and they enjoy civil, if cool, diplomatic relations. Damn! Interesting, interesting, bro. Jtopia, thank you so much for the dono. Berlin, do you believe love at first sight or do I need to walk? Jtopia, you gotta stop this, bro. You gotta stop this, bro. You need to stop, bro. Stop setting me up like that. You about to have me pre-fruiting every single donation, J Jtopia. Do I believe in love at first sight? No. That's bull. You can't just look at somebody and think, oh yeah, this is finna be the one for me, bro. Cause let let hard times start to start to pass. If they don't handle it properly, right? Or if you start tuning out red flags, maybe it's possible. Let's continue about the Turians. Damn, are y'all focused? The Geth are a humanoid race of networked AIs. Robots. They were created by the Quarians 300 years ago as tools of labor and war. One second, one Roughly second. Did you mention Carrions in here? Ago, the Turians were invited to join the, the Turians and the Carrions. Do you hear this? The Geth are a humanoid race of networked AIs. Do they want AIs. me to remember things? They were created by the Quarians 300 years ago as tools of labor and war. When the Geth showed signs of self-evolution, the Quarians attempted to exterminate them. What about them. the Syrians? The Geth won the resulting war. Those are this real people. This example has led to the systematic chat. repression of artificial intelligences in galactic the society. The Geth possess a what unique about the distributed oh, intelligence. An individual has rudimentary animal instincts, but as their numbers and proximity increase, the apparent intelligence of each individual improves. In groups, they can reason, That's terrifying. analyze situations, and use tactics, as well as any organic race. Geth space is located at the trailing end of the Perseus arm, beyond the lawless Terminus systems. The Perseus Veil, an obscuring dark nebula of opaque gas and dust, lies between their space and the Terminus systems. The guests possess a unique distributed intelligence, individuals animalistic. But as their numbers and proximity increase, their apparent intelligence of each other individually, if each individual improves. So it's almost like, bro, it's almost like when you get one iPhone, right? And like, you can't really, like, like, it's like an iPhone, right? It's by itself. It really just do what it do. But then when you have multiple iPhones around each other, then there's airdrop possi possibilities. I get it. I get it. I'm up here with it. I'm up here with it. Spectres are agents from the Office of Special Tactics and Reconnaissance and answer only to the Citadel Council. They are elite military operatives, yep. granted the authority to deal with threats to peace and stability in whatever way they deem necessary. They operate independently or in groups of two or three. Some are empathetic peacekeepers, resolving disputes through diplomacy. Others are cold-blooded assassins, ruthlessly dispatching problem individuals. All get the job done one way or another often operating outside the bounds of galactic law. The Spectres were founded after the Salarians joined the Council. For many years, they operated in secrecy as backroom problem solvers. 
Only after the Krogan rebellions did their activities become publicized. Assignment of a specter is less contentious than a military deployment, but makes it clear that the council is concerned about a situation. Okay, okay, okay. So this is like the council CIA, basically, or like an FBI agent. Private operative. Okay, got you. Got you. Roughly 1200 years ago, Spectres so it's are a it's a Turian the Spectre. The Turian is the race. The Spectre is the occupation. The Heard the you. System. Oh, a timeline. Okay, so let, let's start back for as early as we know. Oh, whoops, went the wrong way. All right, so within our, within our lifetime, we will see Armstrong Outpost at Shackler Crater becomes the first human settlement on Luna. It is formally founded on July 24th, the 100th anniversary of the first lunar landing. When do we go to war? When do we go to war? There it is. All right, all right, here we go. All right, uh, so let's go ahead and keep, keep pressing forward. The beacon's at the far end of this trench. Yeah, we know about the equipment. Run to the waypoint to take cover behind the rock. Take cover by moving, oh, okay. Move to the, and press the left mouse button to fire. And aim out. Yeah, we appreciate that tutorial. Thank you. We appreciate that. Approaching a low object will make you crouch. Just love to control the manual crowd. Okay. Which I want to do, bro. Which I want to do. Come on him. Let me up. Come on him. Press G to throw a grenade. That grenade is fired. How many of those I got? The beacon gone, don't you think? Killing victims instead of just shooting them. There must be some reason behind it. Classic psychological warfare. They're using terror as a weapon. This is a sacrifice. This is the dig site. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side or the gas? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. Probably nightless. You think anyone got out of here alive? If they were lucky. Maybe hiding up in the camp. It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. Bro, y'all love that emo, bro. Change of plans, Shepard. There's a small spaceport up ahead. I want to check it out. I'll wait for you there. You know, I can check my, my emotes and, and I can see like how many times they've been used. On my other ones, probably like, probably like 500, 600 times, 700 times. This one, bro, at least 8,000, bro. And the thing is, bro, y'all ain't really shaking ass for real. Y'all just clicking an emote, bro. Let me do all the work, bro. Not one person has clicked it. And then stood up and did it with me. You know what I'm saying, bro? Like it's just it's a it's a it's a one-man army over here. Hold on. The equipment screen allows you to equip and upgrade gear for your squad. Click the filter tab to switch item types. We all have the same gun, is that what I'm saying? An email gonna be the most used email on Twitch. Bro, as long as you as long as y'all subbing, bro. Anybody can use it, bro. Keep shaking that ass, y'all. Yep. Alley cat and that and that's on cash money. Looks iPhone like waffles, thank you so much for the three months, bro. It's a good place for an ambush. Keep your guard up. <laughs> oh God, they're still alive. What did the Geth do to them? How do I throw people? Put that on one. We'll put that on two. I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put throw on one. Marksman on two, on three. Damage all nearby enemies and objects to make them vulnerable. Yeah, I'm gonna put that on too. 
I did not mean to do that already. Am I trash? Hold on, bro. I can't tell if I'm winning or not. Wouldn't be me if I didn't loot. Yep, take all that. Yep. I look in the chat. Somebody said, neither can we, bud. All right. That door is closed. Security locks engaged. Some locked objects require decryption or electronics to access. If any squad member has a required talent, you will be able to unlock this object using the decryption or electronics interface or by spending Omni Gel. Advance to the central core. Move to the mouse. Move the mouse to move around the ring. Left and right click to move inward and outward. Avoid the security. Huh? 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 Oh, easy enough. Oh, easy enough. Humans, thank the maker. Your second priority, ma'am. Close the door before they come back. Who are you? What are you doing here? I'm Dr. Warren. I was in charge of this excavation. We hid in the shed during the attack. They must have come for the beacon. Luckily, it wasn't here. It was moved to the spaceport earlier this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save us. No one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses will remain. Did you notice a Turian in the area? I saw him, the Prophet, leader of the enemy. He was here, before the attack. That's impossible. Nihilus was with us in the Normandy before the attack. He couldn't have been here. I I'm sorry, Manuel's still a bit... unsettled. We haven't seen your Turian. We've been hiding in here since the attack. Um, what else can you tell me about the attack? It all happened so fast. One second we were gathering up our equipment, the next we were hiding in the shed while the Geth swarmed over the camp. Agents of the Destroyers, bringers of darkness, heralds of our extinction. We could hear the battle outside, gunfire, screams. I thought it would never end. Then everything went quiet. We just sat there, too afraid to move. Until you came along. Can you tell me anything about the beacon? It's some type of data module from a galaxy-wide communications network. Remarkably well preserved. It could be the greatest scientific discovery of our lifetime. Miraculous new technologies, groundbreaking medical advances. Who knows what secrets are locked inside? We have unearthed the heart of evil. Awakened the beast. Unleashed the darkness. Manuel, please. This isn't the time. I'm gonna ask her one more time. Can you tell me anything about the beacon? It's some type of data module from a galaxy-wide communicate okay. miraculous. Manuel, please. This isn't the time. What's wrong with your assistant? Manuel has a brilliant mind, but he's always been a bit unstable. Genius and madness are two sides of the same coin. Is it madness to see the future? To see the destruction rushing towards us? To understand there is no escape, no hope? No, I am not mad. I'm the only sane one left. I gave him an extra dose of his meds after the attack. <laughs> I can shut him up, bro. Relax. Williams, take us to the spaceport. You can't stop it. Nobody can stop it. You can't Night stop the rain. The darkness of eternity. Hush, Manuel. Go lie down. You'll feel better once the medication you kicks in. You can't stop the rain. You don't have anything to loot in here? Just humans, huh? All right. Here it goes. Yep, take all that. Yep, thank you. Thank you, I'm gonna take that too. Thank you. I'm gone, I'm gone, I'm gone. There you go. What type of time is he on? I can't tell. What type of time is he on? Saren. Nihilus. 
This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The Council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. It's like that. It's like what that, bro. Get, up, get off my teammate. Get your ass off my teammate, sir. Now I need, I need, I need guns on. The, I need guns up here. I need guns, bro. How do you? How, you can't quick slot guns. Allows long, bro. Turn your power on. I'm about to die. Hold on, y'all. Hold on, y'all. How do you play this game? I just killed my mans. No, 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 no. We're good. We're. I did. Say JK, say JK, say JK. How do you, uh, how do you, how do you, um, oh, he comes back. Okay, thank you, thank you. Thank you, bro. Well, when does he come back? Like when all the enemies are gone? So that means that, yep, I knew it. I knew it. Eat that. Commander. Oh, that was swaggy. Did he get up? Okay, perfect, perfect. Press V to heal. Oh, clutch. Thank you, bro. Nihilus! Over behind those crates. Wait, don't, don't shoot. I'm one of you. I'm human. What are you doing sneaking around back there? I am sorry, I was hiding from those creatures. My name's Pal. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. I need to know how Nihilus died. The other one got here first. He was waiting when your friend showed up. He, he called him Saren. I, I think they knew each other. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. We were told a Prothean beacon was brought to the spaceport. What happened to it? It's over on the other platform. Probably where that guy Saren was headed. He hopped on the cargo train right after he killed your friend. I knew that beacon was trouble. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I hadn't been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. How come you're the only one who survived? Why didn't anyone else try to hide behind the crates? They never had a chance. I, I, I was already behind the crates when the attack started. Wait a minute. You were hiding behind the crates before the attack? I... Sometimes I need a nap to get through my shift. I sneak off behind the crates to grab 40 winks where the supervisor can't find me. You survived because <laughs> you're lazy? I mean, that's not a reason to make him feel bad about these murders, though. What else do you know about the beacon? Is there bro? anything else you can tell me about the beacon? They brought it here this morning. We loaded it up onto the train and shipped it to the other platform. Hard to believe that was only a few hours ago. Feels like a whole other life. We need to find that beacon before it's too late. Take the cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. I, I, I can't stay here. I need to get away from all this. How do you holster your gun? Oh, H, of course.
I hate how like there's no like real hit markers, bro. Damn. Bro. What what button is he? Oh, D. Okay. Whoops. Upgrade your weapons. Sure, 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 sure. Um, there we go. This is a this is a much better shotgun. The Scimitar One. Yep. Okay, we got armors now. We got armors now. Go ahead and put that heavy armor on. All right. I keep throwing that in on accident. Hold left shift to bring up the power wheel. The power wheel you choose. Use the powers and the special abilities. Okay. That was my job, sir. Good shot. Good shot. I see all up on. I see all up on my body. Like, damn. Those. He's eating those. He's eating those. He's eating those. Get set down. Get set down. I'm on you. I'm on you. I'm on you. Get set down. Yep. Who y'all still shooting at, bro? Talk to me. Talk to me. Yes, trooper. Stop it. I need my team up here, please. Somebody take point. Somebody else take the other point. I'm coming through the middle. I'm coming through the middle. I'm coming through the middle. Dropping bombs. Dropping bombs. Dropping bombs. Dropping bombs. Dropping bombs. I'm about to die here. I'm about to die here. It was, it was a fun game. I'm about to die here. Matter of fact, yep, 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 yep. Go ahead and hit you one of the Medi gels. All right, uh, everybody, yep. Allow long burst, turn up on them, and uh, Allows you to throw enemies and objects using a mask. Yep. Yo, 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 Kaden, make something happen here. You missed, bro. Kaden, you missed, bro. Man, fuck you. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, somebody's right here. Somebody's right here. Cover me. Get the f*** back. Yep, yep. Press, press up now. Press up now. Get up on them. Oh, I killed him off that. I killed him off that. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't say GG yet. Don't say GG yet. Put some respect on my shit, bro. Hold on, hold on. How do you just remove from cover? Nope, nope, nope. I'm here. 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 Oh my gosh, team. We bodied that, y'all. Holster your weapons. Holster your weapons. Yep. Yep. Yeah, we did that, bro. Yes, sir. Don't forget, this is veteran difficulty, bro. Set the charges. Destroy the entire colony. Leave no evidence that we were here. Nah, Saren, you not you not leaving, bro. Oh, Nihilus, you not leaving, bro. I put that on Nihilus, bro. You're not leaving here unscathed. Fucking cr crunchy cricket face ass. Hold on, bro. So they absorb all the dead bodies to then put into a, sa a sarin. Nah, I'm on him. I'm on him. He's not getting away from me. I don't give a fuck if there's geth here. Geth, death, meth. I'm here for all of it, bro. Huh? They got me on a Demolition timer. Charges. The Geth must have planted them. Hurry! We need to find them all and shut them down. Oh, oh I'm built for this, bro. You, 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 man, you, man, you picked the right one, bro. You picked the right one, bro. On me, team. On me. I didn't mean to heal. What's the, what's the button for calling back to me? It's all good. It's all good. Yep. 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 
W meth? No, no, y'all. You you're missing the you're missing my point. What you thought I wasn't gonna shoot you in the face? Move, Ashley. Everybody, move up. Move up with me. Move up with me. Nope. Light him up. Light him up. Light him up. Yep. Yep. Sit him down. Yep. On me. Cover me. Cover me. Cover me. Yo, yo, Caitlin, get the f up there, bro. I swear this is our last mission together, bro. Oh my gosh, I'm mentally disarming it, bro. That's that Vanguard for you. I thought I didn't know my powers yet. Get off the bomb. Nice, 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 nice. I'm running up. I'm throwing somebody off the cliff, bro. Get your bitch ass. I missed him. I no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Look at you trying to hide, bro. What's up? What's up? What's up? What y'all want to do? What y'all want to do? Oh my gosh, bro. All I needed was the right game to, to like let me swag out in. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Take all that. Get troopers where? Oh, no, 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 no. I got something for this. I got something for this. I'm not going to lie. I think controller might be a little better for this game. Let me check out controller, bro. Let me check out controller. Man, it would have been nice to learn this during tutorial. Oh, nah. Oh, nah. Nah, bro. Y'all got him. Y'all got him. Y'all got him. Not now, Commander. Okay, why is heal? RB. Oh, much better, much better. Much better, bro. Even Prime will never be the same again. This is the tutorial. Now, nah, this is this is critical plot points because we saw Nihilus, um, and we and we also got to level um level um two so tutorials level one usually so and I've experienced loss twice they wouldn't do that in tutorial I've I already lost two men so. Talk to Caden, bro. I feel like I've been on his ass. Check your targets. Could be friendlies. It used to be beautiful here. Somehow, some way in the chat said this is the hardest mission in the game, Berlin. Don't listen to them. You know what's crazy? I can't listen to you either, bro. You just sat up here and typed a whole lie and pressed enter. Like, that shit sucks to read, bro. I'm sure it's coming from a good place, but like, I don't know, bro. That's like, I don't know. That's like, that's like receiving Kit Kat when it's, when it's, when it's chicken and vegetables time. So, appreciate you though, bro. Got him. Got him. Got him. I'm out of here. Got him. Yo, it's money. Thank you so much for the four months, bro. Started playing Undertale on my channel, so I plan not to kill anybody. Missed the first couple of streams, but I'm happy to see your face. Hey, money. I'm happy to see yo yo face in the chat in the in the bits. Hey, love you, money. Yo, you have a great time with Undertale. It's a great it's a great time. It's a great time. You know. Allow it to pour into your soul and heart. We found the beacon. You thought you was gonna leave with the beacon, and it's right here in humanity's hands. Big W, Shepard. Normandy, the beacon is secure. This is amazing. Actual working Prothean technology. Unbelievable. It wasn't doing anything like that when they dug it up. Something must have activated it. Yes, yeah, Saran with his Roger ritual. Normandy, standing by. What's going on?
Okay. All right. All right. Oh, not you, bro. Shepherd. No, don't touch it. Too dangerous. Not y'all saying F Ashley in the chat. Whoa. Loki, I'll blame Caden for that. Like he let his guard down, bro. We just met Ashley. We identified the ship that touched down Hold on. Caden Prime. The Normandy. Hold on, who is this? The matriarch. Mommy, mommy, Google go, go, Gaga. You feel me though? Like managed to save the colony. And the beacon. One of the humans may have used it. This human must be eliminated. God damn, bro. Let me not use the Lord's name in vain for animated breasts, bro. Doctor. Dr. Chakwas, I think he's waking up. Lord, forgive me. They don't look clean, bro. You had us worried there, Shepard. How are you feeling? Um. She didn't flinch. Bro, that's, that's the type of, bro. That's what I'm talking about, bro. Saren and the matriarch clearly got a bomb, bro, because she was not phased by that outburst. Which lets me know mentally she is still superior in their relationship. The matriarch, what happened to me? How did I end up here? Who was that? How long was I out? About 15 hours. Something happened down there with the beacon, I think. 15. It's my fault. I must have triggered some kind of security field when I approached it. You had to push me out of the way. You were careless. Low key. I expect better of my people, Williams. You endangered our entire mission. Facts. Don't be so hard on her, Commander. We have no idea if that's what actually set it off. Unfortunately, we'll never get the chance to find out. The beacon exploded. A system overload, maybe. The blast knocked you cold. The lieutenant and I carried you back here to the ship. You know, I can't, I can't just keep hitting her with like, it's okay, baby. Like, I can't keep doing that, bro. Like, at some point, I gotta still remain in my masculine frame. As commander of... But two of my men died, bro. And ain't nobody check me. I'm sorry, Ashley. Thank you for carrying me here. I appreciate it. Mm. Physically, you're fine. But I detected some unusual brain activity. Abnormal beta waves. I also noticed an increase in your rapid eye movement. Signs typically associated with intense dreaming. That's just Banyan. That's just Banyan. It was more like a nightmare. We don't know if that's a vision, bro. We saw a bunch of pasta sauce. I saw... I'm not sure what I saw. Death. Destruction. Cranberry. Really clear. Hmm. I better add this to my report. It may... Oh. Captain Anderson. How's our XO holding up, Doctor? Well, all the readings look normal. I'd say the commander's going to be fine. Glad to hear it. Shepard, I need to speak with you. In private. Aye, aye, Captain. I'll be in the mess if you need me. Now you need to you need Sounds to Sounds like that beacon bro. is pretty hard, Commander. You sure Captain you're Anderson, okay? you wanna to talk to me in private, you need to pay me in public, bro, because you didn't give me any extra bag for that that suicide mission you sent me on, bro. I feel bad about so Ashley Jenkins, right? Why is Williams here? I'm pissed off about the geth. I do feel bad about Jenkins. Bro. I don't like soldiers dying under my command. Jenkins wasn't your fault. You did a good job, Shepard. Chief Williams isn't part of the Normandy crew. I figured we could use a soldier like her. She's been reassigned to the Normandy. Affirmative. Williams is a good <laughs> Lieutenant Elenko agrees with you. That's why I added her to our crew. I'm pissed off about the Geth for sure. Detail dropped the ball, sir. 
We had no idea what we were walking into down there. That's why things went to hell. The Geth haven't been outside the Vale in two centuries, Commander. Nobody could have predicted this. Now that I got, you know, things off my chest, you wanted to talk? You said you needed to see me in private, Captain? I won't lie to you, Shepard. Things look bad. Nihilus is dead. The beacon was destroyed and Geth are invading. The Council's going to want answers. Bro, f*** them, bro. The Council can kiss my ass. I won't let them blame me for losing the beacon. I didn't do anything wrong. Talk to him. I'll stand behind you and your report, Shepard. You're a damned hero in my books. That's not why I'm here. It's Saren, that other Turian. I like Saren Captain Anderson. Center, one of the best, a living legend. But if he's working with the Gith, it means he's gone rogue. A rogue Spectre's trouble. Saren's dangerous, and he hates humans. Why? He thinks we're growing too fast, taking over the galaxy. A lot of aliens think that way. Most of them don't do anything about it. But Saren has allied himself with the Geth. I don't know how. I don't know why. I only know it had something to do with that beacon. Mm. You were there just before that beacon self-destructed. Did you see anything? Any clue that might tell us what Saren was after? Um, yeah, tell me what you saw, bro. Just before I lost consciousness, I had some kind of vision. A vision? A vision of what? He looked like a young Mike Tyson. That's who I see when I look at him, bro. Berlin character can't pull off the no eyebrows look. He pulling it off, though. He's pulling. Y'all still stuck on my man's eyebrows, bro. Did you see what he just went through? Imagine waking up after a 15 hour coma after after starting the beacon and having somebody be like, but your eyebrows put yourself in his shoes, bro. You think he wants to read the chat saying that, bro? What did what? How did you decipher this? How did you decipher this? That looked like war. I saw synthetics. Geth, maybe. Super Saiyan J. SSJ eyebrows having ass. We need to report this to the council, Shepard. What do we say, bro? What are we gonna tell him? I had a bad dream. We don't know what information was stored in that beacon. Lost Prothean technology. Blueprints for some ancient weapon of mass destruction, whatever it was. Saren took it. But I know Saren. I know his reputation, his politics. He believes humans are a blight on the galaxy. This attack was an act of war. He has the secrets from the beacon. He has an army of Geth at his command, and he won't stop until he's wiped humanity from the face of the galaxy. I mean... It's such a random, like, not if I, bro, like, bro, you just learned about this yesterday. I'm gonna just say, you're right. I'll find some way to take That's him not down. what I told you to say. It's not that easy. He's a specter. He can go anywhere, do almost anything. That's why we need the council on our side. We expose him. Perfect. We prove Saren's gone rogue, and the council will revoke his specter status. I'll contact the ambassador and see if he can get us an audience with the council. He'll want to see us as soon as we reach the Citadel. We should be getting close. Head up to the bridge and tell Joker to bring us into dock. This game pacing kind of cool. Wee! I want to go talk to Ashley real quick. Hey, Commander. Duh, you, you, speaking of. I'm glad you're okay, Commander. The crew could use some good news after what happened to Jenkins. Soldiers die is crazy. Jenkins was a valuable part of this crew. Part of me feels guilty over what happened. If Jenkins was still alive, I might not be here. You're a good soldier, Williams. You belong on the Normandy. Thanks, Commander. I appreciate that. Things were pretty rough down there. Are you okay? I've seen friends die before. It comes with being a Marine. But to see my whole unit wiped out, and you never get used to seeing dead civilians. Right. But things would have been a lot worse if you hadn't shown up. Bro, do y'all, yeah, like, like, bro, do y'all, y'all get the energy that she's giving out right now, bro? Like, damn, we just got, we, like, you're part of the Normandy, bro. We get it, bro. Can you focus on the mission? We couldn't have done it without you, Williams. Thanks, Commander. 
I have to admit, I was a little worried about being assigned to the Normandy. It's nice when someone makes you feel welcome. She on me heavy. She on me heavy. Don't disappoint me. Glad to have you. I think you're going to fit in here just fine, Williams. Thanks, Commander. Here comes Shayla in the chat. I think it's just you, bro. You, you're not peeking up. You're not reading in between the lines. This must be your first time seeing, um, seeing, um, space, space romance. Yes, Commander. Is there something you need? What happened to me? How did you end up serving on an Alliance ship? Oh. I enlisted right out of med school. Earth always seemed boring to me. Too safe. Too secure. I figured the colonies were teeming with exotic adventure. I wanted to travel the stars, tending the wounds of tough soldiers with piercing eyes and sensitive souls. <laughs> Turns out military life isn't quite as romantic as I'd imagined. But humanity needs the Alliance if we want to keep expanding through the Traverse. And the Alliance always needs good doctors. So I stayed on to do my part. We appreciate you, Dr. Chakwas. We appreciate you. She basically saying, bro, she she needs some. She needs some more. She needs some more, bro. How about Captain what Anderson? Do you know about Captain Anderson? I've served with him for a few tours now. He knows when to let things slide. And Gertrude, come on, y'all. The crew knows he's seen pretty much anything they'll ever run into, and he cares about the people under his command. We care about him too. What about Kaiden? What you feeling about Kaiden? How well do you know the lieutenant? I'd never worked with him before this mission, but he has an impressive service record. Over a dozen special commendations. Tends to keep to himself, though. Maybe because of the headaches. It's not easy being an L2. An L2? What does that have to do with it? Well, most biotics now use the L3 implants. Lieutenant Alenko was wired with the old L2 configuration. Sometimes there are complications. My codex is probably lit up right now. What kind of complications? Severe mental disabilities, insanity, crippling physical pain. Mm. There's a long list of horrific side effects. Caden's lucky. He just gets migraines. Appreciate the talk. I should go. Goodbye, Commander. Go to the cockpit and tell Joker to bring the Norbity into the dock at the Citadel. Nah, bro. I, I, I gotta give up on it, bro. The Earth, the Earth, I don't know about it, bro. I don't know about it, bro. I don't know about it, bro. Somebody put me onto the hollow earth theory and I'm like, bro, I'm just here, bro. I'm just here, bro. I'm just here, bro. Ain't nobody gonna hear me, bro. I'm just- Go just... speak to Joker when you're ready. Tell him to bring the Normandy into dock. What if I did this instead? Yes, sir. Hush now, Berlin. All, all right, bro. We'll be quiet, bro. Hell yeah, the Normandy's the Normandy is great. I love it. I love it here. All my homies on the ship. Navigator Presley, Glad how you doing, okay, sir? Commander. Losing Jenkins was hard enough on the crew. I appreciate your concern, sir. Nav manual. All right, got a little bit of codex action. Bro, where's Caden at? I want to talk to Caden about the loss of our soldier. You really thought the earth was flat? Hey, bro, you know what's crazy about conspiracies, bro? People can talk and discuss and just kind of like, just kind of like ponder the thoughts of, of reality. But as soon as somebody mentioned the idea of flat earth, bro, they get laughed out the fucking room, bro. I just think it's a, I just think it's an interesting idea. Don't you, bro? Glad to see you're okay, Commander. Aiden, you're going to die probably first, bro. You have no lines. You have no dialogue. Earth ain't flat is why. Bro, bro, and you, you probably right, bro. But did, do you know about why they think it's flat, bro? Have you looked into that? Or are you just, man, shut the <laughs> Like, bro, is that you, bro? Because you be, you'd probably be intrigued by why people think it's flat, bro. Because I, I think it's a pretty cool idea. Right? We can all buy into concepts that are, that might be ridiculous, right? 
from the outside looking in. Good timing, Commander. I was just about to bring us into the Citadel. I'm leave it alone. See that taxpayer money at work. Let's get to the Citadel, bro. Let's expose Saren, bro. Let's stay on task. My boy Luvito said, it's illogical. See, I, I like that response more than I do most. We're going to talk about this, bro. We're going to talk about this. Because what this is explaining us is... Uh, Clearly, the Earth isn't flat. Clearly, there's no firmament over the Earth. And there's a space station hub supporting millions of lives. Look at the size of that ship. The Ascension, flagship of the Citadel fleet. Well, size isn't everything. Why so touchy, Joker? I'm just saying you need firepower, too. Because this reality is way that cooler to me. This main gun could rip through the barriers in any ship in the Alliance fleet. Good thing it's on our side, then. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy, requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Like, let me ask y'all, bro. Clearance granted. Hold on. Begin your approach. Transferring you to an Alliance operator. We made it. Roger, Alliance Tower, Normandy out. Normandy, this is Alliance Tower. Please proceed to dock 422. You all, do you all see this being reality one day? 100, 200 years from now? Is this what we will be living in? Or is this just some fiction bullshit, bro? Y'all said hell no. I think it's possible. No, we boring. I hope this it's kind of cool. Outrage. The council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony. Hold on. The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Seren? You can't just ignore a rogue specter. I demand action. You don't get to make demands of a council ambassador. Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Saren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Oh, I get it. Anderson, I see you brought half your crew with you. Just the ground team from Eden Prime. In case you had any questions. I have the mission reports. Oh, I think I... I assume they're accurate? They are. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Seren's their top agent. They don't like him being accused. Of hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, 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 th so those of you who have... Hold on. Nah, we too simple-minded for the technical advancements that other life forms out there have. Also, we too MF and violent and have superiority complex. Bro, that, that comment's gonna make me go off topic. But I hear you, though. What I was about to say was for those of those of you who have played this game before because of the what are they called the Tyrians and the humanity and the humans war Saren is trying to pin the beacon being destroyed on humanity so everybody's looking at the humans like you're the problem I think that's what's going on here now if we get back okay cool 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 cool, cool. so to get back to your point bro I do think that there's going to come a time when like as a, as as like hum, as like how can we say this? I feel like it's not our fault that we are what did you call it? Mentally, I can't remember the the way that you put it. I don't think it, that it's our fault that humanity is like behind when it comes to what we could be. I think that like we have been put in a, in systems that create us to be docile mentally you know what i'm saying but i do think there will come a time when like all of us together realize you know what we've been we're like like we are living the same way that everybody say it bro we are living in a matrix now it's not god's fault bro it's the people who created the matrix you know what i mean religion's involved in there i think school's involved in there i think um i think law is involved in there i think all these things will like everybody's gonna start looking around and being like yo we're living at like 10 percent of what we could be somebody said gazer gazer bro let's let's just focus on the game bro but this is why i like to play games like this because it got us talking you know what i'm saying uh i mean all futuristic sci-fi humans stopped warring amongst themselves so we'll probably not reach spacefaring <laughs> until we as a species stop killing one another Mm. Saren's a threat to every human colony out there. I didn't mean if to click that. If they stop him, I will. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. 
The mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was destroyed. That's Saren's fault, not his. Then we better... Let's go, Anderson. The investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I want to go over a few things before the hearing. Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. And that's why I hate politicians. Right, they worried about my damn Spectre application, bro. Bro, Saren's about to wage war on everybody. Follow the pulsing arrow on your radar to the Citadel Tower. Let me talk to my team. Tell the aliens from the animals. Mm, message. Caden sucks, bro. Caden's really garbage. He's he's. It's all good, bro. Y'all just keep storing up your channel points. I'm I'm gonna have something for y'all soon, bro. Yeah, I, yeah, I'm finna crack your PC. I'm finna hack your PC. I'm about to hack your PC. Alliance patrol report. Captain Hendrickson reported some unusual energy readings during a patrol of the Argos Row cluster. She had particular concerns about the Hydra system, but was recalled before her team could investigate further. No patrols are scheduled for that sector. Do you want to send in a recon team? While on the Citadel, you uncovered an Alliance patrol report. One of the patrols mentioned some strange activity in the Hydra system of the Argos Row cluster. We'll go there if we have like for board. Expose Saren. You have to. Pr yeah. Oh wait, what? You have to prove to the Citadel Council that Saren, one of the Spectre agents, has gone rogue. Go to the Citadel Tower on the Presidium for an audience with the Council, and then we'll go here. The Citadel. The Council is an executive committee composed of representatives from the Asari Republics, the Turian Hierarchy, and the Salarian Union. Though they have no official power over the independent governments of other species. The Council's decisions carry great weight throughout the galaxy. No single Council race is strong enough to defy the other two, and all have a vested interest in compromise and cooperation. Each of the Council species has general characteristics associated with the various aspects of governing the galaxy. The Asari are typically seen as diplomats and mediators. The Salarians gather intelligence and information, the Turians provide the bulk of the military and peacekeeping forces. Any species granted an embassy on the Citadel is considered an associate member, bound by the accords of the Citadel conventions. Associate members may bring issues to the attention of the Council, though they have no input on the decision. The Human Systems Alliance became an associate member of the Citadel in 2165. Bro, I know what Tyrians look like. I imagine Asari is the girl in the purple. I remember the that. But then Spectre, what the hell? The Citadel. Spectre. Do the um from the, the council is an executive Do the Salarians look like? Rough. The so we just haven't came across them yet. After. All right. Um System Alliance military jargon. Okay, let me see this. Ashore. When a ship's crew levels the vessel, leaves the vessel, they are ashore. All right away when a ship releases the equipment tethering all right it is away all right got it i i the proper way to acknowledge an order if told to attack the correct response is i i sir all right perfect if asked are you proud to be a marine the correct response is yes sir okay got it so the i is for an order asap we know that belay bridge okay yep yep cic all right sure damage control I heard him say XO. There we go. Executive. Oh, okay. Executive officer. The second in command of an Alliance warship. Got it. Sit rep abbreviation of situational report and evaluation of the current military situation. Bro, you could really get lost in this game, bro. Let me stop. Let me stop, bro. Let's, let's make it happen. Danielle, what's good? Thank you so much for the dono. Saren is kind of hot, to be honest. I'd let him take me out on a date. Yeah, you gonna let him take you out on a date till he till dinner's over and he goes. Then what are you gonna do, Danielle? My mother told me about you. How does how does Saren still somehow get the girls, bro? But y'all swear y'all. Oh my gosh, bro. No, I don't like bad boys. I want me somebody with. 
Six figure, eight figure. Like, bro. Welcome to the Allow me to be your guide. Saren's still bagging, bro. And he about to destroy everybody. Good day, Commander. The human ambassador is up the stairs, first room on the right. How long you been, ha how long you had locks? Hold on. What? Good day, Commander. The human ambassador is up the stairs, first room to the right. Commander? You know who I am? Yes, I receive reports on all new arrived. Saren is just a gangster roach. Stop, stop, bro. Let's let's not make him cool, please. Yes, I receive reports on all newly arrived dignitaries and notable people. Ooh, ooh, let's go. What is this place? This is the Presidium. More specifically, you are at the Citadel embassies. She got them. If you have more questions, please access Savina. She got them, Allen Iverson braids. If you have more questions, please access Avina. What's that? Oh, Avina is the virtual guide for the Citadel. Feel free to access the terminal yourself. Thank you very much. What's your name? What do you do here? My name is Sephiria. I'm the administrative assistant for the embassies. Sephiria is a great name, actually. Administrative assistant for the embassies. You seem to be distracted. The embassies are the hub of all Citadel politics. <laughs> when you represent trillions of citizens, it tends to get a little busy. Amy Schumer avatar looking ass. All right, bro. That was extremely detailed, bro. You definitely in the right community. The embassies are the hub of all Citadel politics. When you represent trillions of citizens, it tends to get a little busy. What is this place? Oh, we this already heard this. Precinct. We already heard this. If you have more I should be going now. Have a pleasant day. You too, ma'am. God bless. Allow me to be your guide. Hi, Avina. Heard Ladies about you. And welcome to the Presidium. My name is Avina, and I am pleased to be your virtual guide throughout this level of the Citadel Space Station. So are you a person or a program? I am a fully interactive virtual intelligence. Program to no. spontaneous guidance at predetermined locations of interest throughout this level of the Citadel. I may also be contacted through any of the Presidium VI terminals should you require assistance. This Siri in 50 years. In your house. Waiting for you to talk to her. Listening to everything. Give me the tour. You are standing at Presidium Tourism Terminal 1. On either side of this lobby are the embassies of the various Citadel races, along with CSEC headquarters. On the far end of this level, you can see the Citadel Tower, where the Council meets regularly to discuss matters of interstellar importance. I look in the chat, the homie LJ said, so you lost your eyebrows in space? Bro, this isn't my character, bro. I just tried to make somebody black. Don't make this personal, bro, because now you're insulting me. <laughs> I want to know more about Citadel security. Citadel security serves as law enforcement for all regions of the Citadel, though the majority of officers serve in the wards. Executor Palin, a Turian, is the current head of CSEC, but individuals from virtually every species across Citadel space serve as officers beneath him. If you wish to learn more... Executor I didn't hear Palin's anything right now because I'm still thinking about my Goodbye. eyebrows, bro. Restart Goodbye, the convo. Thank you for using Avena. Shh, I'm not finished. I'm not finished. I'm not finished. Welcome to Presidium Tourism. On the far end of this level, you can see the Citadel Tower. Okay. Where the council meets regularly to discuss matters of interstellar importance. Okay, that way is, yep, cool. CSEC. I want to know more about Citadel security. Citadel security serves as law enforcement for all regions of the Citadel, though the majority of officers serve in the wards. Executor Palin, a Turian, is the current head of CSEC. But individuals from virtually every species across Citadel space serve as officers beneath him. If you wish to learn more, Executor Palin's office is located in the CSEC headquarters. I'm gonna go talk to him. 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 Goodbye, and thank you for using Avina. Please enjoy your visit to the Citadel. I'm gonna go talk to him eventually, bro. I want to explore a little bit more. To embassies, to Citadel Tower. How you doing, bro? You cool, bro? My fault, OG. I didn't mean to get all up on you on, on you like that, bro. Yo, bro, how you doing, man? Let me ask you something. How come y'all don't how come y'all don't really like humans like that, bro? Okay, well f you too. F fake ass Sonic the Hedgehog pine cone head ass cricket. Oh nah, bro. Oh, nah, bro. 
No, sir, bro. This shit look like a fungus, bro. There we go. I knew y'all was going to start doing that too, bro. As soon as I got close to him, I already knew when I looked over, I was going to see there go Berlin in the game. All right, bro. Oh, that's a Solarian. Yo, Kara, Kara, thank you. Thank you, bro. Thank you, bro. So that's a Solarian. Okay. Okay. All right. Hey guys, I got a joke for you. So, so an Ashina, a, a Tyrion, and, uh, and a Solarian will all walk into a bar. And then the human walks in after. <laughs> what the hell is this thing then, bro? Hell nah, bro. That's who you, this is exactly the, the type of y'all gonna get catfished in, catfished by in the metaverse, bro. You're gonna take your headsets off. You're gonna look at them and it's gonna be that, bro. Citadel Tower, please. That's the cricket from Emmett from Men in Black. You sure have to climb a lot of stairs to reach the council. I think that's supposed to be symbolic of their importance. I bet all these staircases aren't just for show. They make for good defensive positions if this place is ever attacked. This elevator leads down to the Presidium. There you will find the embassies, the Citadel Tower, the Emporium, the Bank, and the Consort Chambers. Behind you is the Citadel Tower. The Council convenes at the far end. Bro, I know. I want to see how you get here without the car. Come on. Come on. Get here. Thank you. Oh my gosh, bro. Look at the squad, bro. Just have to trust Ambassador Udina. No, we don't, sir. Yo, Caden is actually garbage, bro. Oh, I was right here. I was literally right here. Okay. 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 Noted. 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 Let's just let's just look at the city square real quick. They got birds in space. That motherfuckers is not real, bro. I'm just kidding, bro. You know, just another theory. Just another theory that, that's out there that people think about. In light know? of the recent attack on Eden Prime, many colonial investors are pulling their support for future projects. Proponents of expanded human colonization insist that Eden Prime was an isolated case. Nevertheless, colonist enrollment has dropped sharply. Many colonial proposals are on hold until backers have some reassurance that human colonies will be adequately protected. That's actually crazy. That's actually crazy that people can be like can be colonists as a job now. You can though they will move you to a desolate area. Bro, can you do that now? Can you get paid to do that now? Probably not. I don't think so. Garrus, the executor. Sam's hiding something. Give me more time. Stall them. Stall the council. Don't be ridiculous. Your investigation is over, Garrus. What's good, Garrus? Commander Shepard, Garrus Vicarian. I was the officer in charge of the CSEC investigation into Saren. Mmm. Who were you just talking to? That was Executor Palin, head of Citadel Security, my boss. He'll be presenting my findings on Saren to the Council. You don't like Saren, bro, and I like that about you. Sounds like you really want to bring him down. I don't trust him. Something about him rubs me the wrong way. But he's a specter. Everything he touches is classified. I can't find any hard evidence. I think the council's ready for us, Commander. Caden, I think Good you should shut it. your ass Maybe up. Maybe they'll listen to you. Yo, Garrus, 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 bro. Garrus, bro. Because I don't know about this nigga over here on the right, bro. But after this meeting, let me holler at you, bro. Let me holler at you, bro. You don't want to keep the council waiting. Let me holler at you after this, bro. Rear Admiral no, Kahoku. I'm waiting to speak with one of the council's assistants. Commander. I keep walking up to people thinking they're going to give me a combo and they just commander me the whole time, bro. There, there go, there go big bro. The hearings already started. Come on. This is OG right here. How is the hearing started? And I'm not even here yet. 
They don't want humans. Death attack is a matter of some concern, but there is nothing to indicate Saren was involved in any There's way. plenty to the indicate. Investigation by Citadel Security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. Right. We've read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker is hardly compelling proof. I resent these accusations. Nihilus was a fellow Spectre and a friend. That just let you catch him off guard. Captain Anderson, you always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges against me. This ain't the first time. And this must be your protege. Can I'll beat your ass. 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 Sorry, Commander Anderson. The mission to Eden Prime was top secret. The only way you could know about the beacon was if you were there. With Nihilus gone, his files passed on to me. I read the Eden Prime report. I was unimpressed. But what can you expect from a human? That's a little, that's a little, I don't know about that one, bro. I don't know about that one. Is that what we have next, right? Cause we are talking about the future of humanity, right? We already discussed in order for humanity to reach, to reach the next level, we have to stop fighting with each other. So now it goes from racist to species. That's the floodgates opening. That's the floodgates. Oh, no, nah, bro. We ain't never going to get it right. What is the point of living, bro? That's why I'm going to just I'm going to just read the good book. I'm going to say my prayers for people. I'm going to keep making these ducats, these increments. And I'm getting my bunker and you won't see me in a, in a, in a few, bro. Anybody want to come to the Easy Gang bunker when World War Three strikes? You're free to you're free to come, bro. Just make sure you bring good comics, good board games. You don't you you you, you don't stink, bro. Right? You shower, your hygiene's on point. Um, that's all I got for right now. If y'all come up with some more requirements, bro. Hey, active! Oh, absolutely, absolutely. You have to be a Halo player, bro. I don't want to hear any Call of Duty, bro. There's you got about 20, 30 versions, bro, and you still ain't got it right. So. Halo players only. Um, we will allow Smash Bros competitors as well. And uh, we'll keep working on the requirements from there. Saren despises humanity. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. You're not ready to join the council. You're not even ready to join the Spectres. Aren't you on trial? There's no right to say that. That's not his decision. Shepard's admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. Thank this you, Tevos. No Thank purpose. you, Tevos. The humans are wasting your time, counselor, and mine. All of these are going to get me in trouble with the council, bro. Oh, no, no, no. I like this one. I like this one. You can't hide behind the council forever. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? I agree. Our judgment must be based on facts and evidence, not wild imaginings and reckless speculation. Do you have anything else to add, Commander Shepard? Bro, I'm about to get in trouble, bro. You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. The Council has found no evidence of any connection between Saren and the Geth. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. You are a... Oh my gosh, bro. It's Sunday. This meeting is adjourned. What is this, game over? Like... It was a mistake bringing you into that hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Every colony we have is at risk. Every world we control is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. I didn't know about you and Saren. This is my first time hearing this. Tell me about this history between you and Saren. I worked with him on the You could have stayed at the time. door. Things went bad real bad we shouldn't talk about this here but i know what he's like and he has to be stopped bro you literally could have stayed on the damn normandy bro and i would have it's all good because you would he wasn't even there at the beacon what's our next step 
As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. We need to find some way to expose him. What about Garrus, that CSEC investigator? We saw him arguing with the executive. You're, he's going to That's replace right. you. He was asking for more time to finish his report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. I'm, I'll talk to him. Any idea where we could find him? I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Forget it. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. I won't waste my time with that loser. You won't have to. I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. I'm on it. I don't want to say that. No, I'm on it, sir. You can trust me, sir. I'll take care of it. I need to take care of some business. Captain, meet me in my office later. Because you got the eyes of a Solarian, sir. And Hawkins probably getting drunk at Cora's Den. All right, sir. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the wards. You do got Solarian eyes. I'm not going to lie to you, bro. Somebody has some passion in his ancestry. Uh, it's a dingy little... In the other leaves? Maybe there's another way to find evidence against Saren. You should talk to Barla Vaughn over in the financial district. Rumor has it he's an agent for the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? An information dealer. Buys and sells secrets to the highest bidder. I've heard Barla Vaughn's one of the top representatives. He might know something about Saren. But his information won't come cheap. You and Saren have a history. What happened? About 20 years ago, I was part of a mission in the Skillian Verge. I was working with Saren to find and remove a known terrorist threat. Okay. Saren eliminated his target. But a lot of people died along the way. Innocent people. And the official records just covered it all up. But I saw how he operates. No conscience. No hesitation. He'd kill a thousand innocent civilians to end a war without a second thought. <laughs> Oh my gosh, bro. They let you really say so at all. I'm going to say it, bro. Sometimes a thousand people must die so a million can live. But only if there's no other way. Saren doesn't even look for another option. He's twisted, broken. He likes the violence, the killing. And he knows how to cover his tracks. Killing innocents doesn't end wars. It causes them. I know how the world works. Shepard, are you okay, Shepard? Sometimes you're forced to make unpleasant decisions. But only if there's no other way. Saren doesn't even look for another option. He's twisted, broken. He likes the violence, the killing. And he knows how there to There goes Berlin in a game. Y'all got Our me twisted, bro. doesn't seem to get along with the Council. He's just frustrated. The Council's always preaching that we need to be part of the galactic community. But for them, it's a one-way street. They want us to expand and settle unstable regions like the Skillian Verge and the Attican Traverse. But when we run into trouble, they don't want to help us out. Everyone knows it's only a matter of time until we get a seat on the council. The ambassador just thinks it should happen sooner rather than later. And I agree. Who cares if we get a seat on the council? What's the big deal? If the council passes a ruling on an interstellar matter, we have to follow it. We don't have the fleets or political allies to defy them. Once we get a seat on the council, we'll be able to influence those rulings. Protect our own interests. Boy, hell no, nah, bro. Whenever we want something. Take this mess we're in now. If humanity had a seat on the council, we'd just send the Citadel fleet out to take care of Saren and his geth. No, Problem we solved. wouldn't. No, we wouldn't. They still have to vote for it as a council, bro. This dude, this dude put too much faith in the in in them bro hell no nah. he tripping bro my fit is trash you would you bro you wouldn't know space drip if it slapped you in the face bro trust me bro you wouldn't i'm clean boy you see you see how my neck piece is a chainmail ode to the past the medieval time period that probably nobody really knows about which is a classic piece take this mess we're in now the shadow broker talk about tell him. me more about the shadow broker he's a necessary evil of galactic politics Buying and selling information is a part of the game. And the Shadow Broker just happens to be the best player on the field. Always sells to the highest bidder. Doesn't get involved in politics. Doesn't pick sides. A simple system. You still ain't got eyebrows. He's not a threat to anyone. Not directly. He's just a resource we can use. Bro. Or she is. Or maybe they are. You, Nobody bro, y'all always say things and make me forget Tell the me points. The hold on, hold on. He's a necessary evil of galactic politics. Okay. Buying and selling. 
always sells to the highest bidder. He's not a threat to anyone, not directly. He's just a resource we can use, or she is. Or maybe they are. Nobody really knows. Um, Barlavon, talk about them. Tell me about Barlavon. He specializes in moving large sums of money without leaving a paper trail. A financial genius doesn't do anything illegal, but he knows all the loopholes. He's got an impressive client list. Ambassadors, diplomats, specters. That's probably why the Shadow Broker uses him. You don't think much of Harkin. The guy joined CSEC about 20 years ago. He's been an embarrassment to our species ever <laughs> since. Roughing up suspects in custody, bribery accusations, alcohol and drug use. The embassy used to step in when he got in trouble. But I guess enough was enough. The guy's a scumbag. He should have been cut loose a long time ago. He was one of the first human CSEC officers. Guess it would have looked bad if he got fired. A lot of backroom deals were worked out over the years to keep him on the force. Politics is a dirty business sometimes, but it looks like his time's run out. We've got enough humans in CSEC now to stop protecting him. I should go. Good luck, Shepard. I'll be over in the ambassador's office if you need anything else. Berlin, your character looked like he's seen some evil shit. Bro, he has. Were you not here for the beacon? Like, bro, get off my man back. He's going through a lot right now. Oh my gosh, bro. Y'all on, on this bumper, bro. For what? Berlin, complete as many side missions as you possibly can. They make a big difference in Mass Effect 2 and 3. Okay. Then if that's the case, let's go to the journal real quick. Argos Row. Okay, I thought that's what they were saying, but they were saying Bobo something else. Expose uh, Saren. You need to find some proof that Saren is connected. So that sounds like a main one. Uh, speak to Harkin. Go to Charles Den in the lower wards and speak with Harkin, a C-Sec agent who might know where Garrus can be found. And then an agent for the Shadow Broker named Barlow Vaughn might be able to provide you with some more info. Okay, so let, let's let's get Garrus. Let's get Garrus first. We're headed to uh, Charles Den in the lower wards. Let's go. Hold on. We got some codex. Biotics is a virtual intelligence is an advanced form of user interface software. VIs use a variety of methods to simulate natural conversation, including an audio interface and an avatar personality to interact with. Although a VI can provide a convincing emulation of sentience, they are not self-aware, nor can they learn or take independent action. All right, yeah. This will probably be out of this video game. We probably gonna see a these first. We're probably gonna see these first. Before we see any of these council, non-council stuff, bro, we gonna see that for sure. The Asari were the first, the second species to join the. The Asari Hold were on. the first species to discover the citadel. When the Salarians arrived, it was the Asari who proposed the establishment of the Citadel yeah. Council. Alan Iverson, Alan Iverson braids for sure. Since then, the Asari have served as the mediators and centrists of the Council. An all-female race, the Asari reproduce through a form of parthenogenesis. They nah, bro, I need to see what that looks like. Our and no genesis you have a mom and a dad and maybe a few siblings yep you are different maybe very different from everyone else in your family okay what would you and your siblings look like if you came from only a mother with no father would you look just like your mom i imagine just so like your siblings in the ovaries of a female diploid oogonia divide by mitosis to produce more oogonia and specialized primary oocytes still diploid that are committed to producing eggs. Yeah, I remember doing a, 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 a art, art work like the this. The eggs may then be fertilized by a it was meiosis, mitosis, Fritos, Lay's, uh, Cheetos, Doritos, whole Eatos family. Can't say, I can't say I'm not confused, bro. So we just gonna keep playing. I try, bro. Sir, I know you're not getting any work done over here, sir. That shit cap, bro. You ain't doing nothing over here. We're, we're talking about, bro. Let me go ahead downstairs. How do I get downstairs? Sure would like to go. There it is.
they said parthenogenesis is a way of procreating without sperm heard it heard you heard you i'd like to go to the ward's locations please and please take me to chores den please i have to figure out how how to get to these places without without the car so let me just go out, go out here real quick Like, how would I have ever known? Or even am I? I'll just keep using the car. Forget this. Divided between all of us like Jesus? Nah, bro. Jesus, he got the, he got the perfect cut. You know what I'm saying? That's him. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are we talking about? What are we talking about? What the? Bro, 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 bro. Nope, 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 nope. Don't, Don't panic. Don't panic. Don't panic. Don't panic. Bro, 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 sit down, bro. Where's the menu where I can use their powers? There it is. You got a map throw, bro. Throw is the one. Put bitch ass down. Run up on him. Run up on him. Hit him, hit him with the shotgun to the chest. Oh my gosh, clown. Perimeter clear. This, this, Here it this, comes. this must be his favorite song. How do you use heels in a oh, why, why, why? Well, the combat feel kind of cool in this. How do you holster weapons? Back. Okay, got it. So none of y'all, none of y'all heard that outside. I see a lot of humans in here. None of y'all heard this outside. Me getting shot at the commander. He got STD. Hold on, baby. Hold on now. Hold on now. Let me relax into it. Is this TOS? Is this TOS? Is this TOS? What if I lean forward? Is it TOS then? If I show her I'm interested? No, no, no. Relax into it, bro. Oh my gosh, y'all. Oh my gosh, y'all. Thank you for that. Thank you for that. I ain't got I ain't got no caps for you, but that's a great, that's a great movement. Yo. Yo, Kaden, I swear you're done, bro. You see how he ran up on my girl as soon as I leave, bro? Bro, you can't trust those kind of dudes, bro. Go away. I'm not interested in talking. Are you interested in fighting, sir? Oh my gosh, you're lucky. Not now. Watch the show. What what are what are these women called, bro? They're called the uh, As Asari? The yeah. The Asari. Okay, yep. Back off, Rex. Fizz told us to take you down if you showed up. What are you waiting for? I'm standing right here. Oh, Rex pulled up. This is Fist's only chance. If he's smart, he'll take it. He's not coming out, Rex. End of story. This story is just beginning. That's a terrifying threat, bro. Out of my way, humans. I have no quarrel with you. What was that all about? Who knows? Let's just try not to get caught in the middle. Hold on, hold on. What you mean, try not to get caught in the middle, bro? Why else would I play this? Was it, oh, it was him he was talking to? The back rooms are private, reserved for Fist and his friends. Reserved for Fist and his friends? Who's friends, sir? Let, 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 bro, let's go holler at Rex, bro. Rex is, Rex is pissed, bro. I mean, I guess we can talk to Harkin first, but. Rex leave? military <laughs> I could have been a marine you know instead I joined the goddamn citadel security the biggest mistake of my life oh where's Garrus I'm looking for a CSEC officer a Turian named Garrus Garrus <laughs> you must be one of Captain Anderson's crew poor bastard still trying to bring Saren down eh? I know where Garrus is you gotta tell me something first did the captain let you in on his big secret 
The way some of y'all would risk <laughs> the way some y'all would risk it for some Krogan though. <laughs> God damn, bro. Hey Danielle, let us know. Let us know. You've been real quiet since we talked about the Terrian earlier. She been real quiet. Oh my god, Saren's so hot. I let him take me out on a date. What you think about Big Rex? What y'all think about Big Rex in the chat? We about to see. We're about to talk to Rex in a second, bro. We'll see. We'll see if Rex masculine energy rubs off on Ashley and I lose my chick. I know where Garrus is, but you got to tell me something first. Did the captain let you in on his big secret? What secret, bro? Is there something I should know about the captain? The captain used to be a specter. Didn't know that, did you? It was all very hush hush. Oh. The first human ever given that honor. And then he blew it. Screwed up his mission so bad they kicked him out. Of course, he blames Saren. Says the Turians set him up. Interesting. How do you know this? You said they covered all this up. How do you hear about it? I spent 20 years working cases here on the Citadel. People on this station love to talk. Secrets are like herpes. If you got them, might as well spread them around. Is that what they say? Is that what they do with the herp? What went wrong? How do you know this? You're lying, bro. Why'd they kick him out? I have to ask him. I never heard any of the details. But it's a good story, though. The hero's fall. Classic tragedy. <laughs> Just tell me where Garrus went. Garrus was sniffing around Dr. Michelle's office. She runs the med clinic on the other side of the wards. Last I heard, he was going back there. How well do you know Captain Anderson? Met him a few times over the years. One of those hardcore military guys. Yes, sir. No, sir. Can't have any fun with a stick up your ass, sir. <laughs> That's probably why he climbed the Alliance rank so fast. The military loves brown nosers. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Take up for your, for your commander, bro. I mean, for your captain. The captain's a good soldier. Sure, whatever. Dress him in a fancy suit, pin some shiny medals on his chest, and call him a hero. Everybody else does. You're a drunk hater. But if he's so great, why'd the Spectres kick him out? Why'd you go ask him about that? You need to look in a mirror. Sober up and take some responsibility for yourself. Save your sermons. This ain't no church. W. Shepard in the chat. W. Shepard. Weppard in the chat. What's it like working for CSEC? You mean, what was it like? The executor suspended me without pay. Recurring violations. CSEC was keeping a file on me. Can you believe that? Every mistake I ever made went into the books. Get a little rough with a suspect, note in the file. Have a couple of drinks on duty, note in the file. Skim a couple of credits off a drug bus, note in the file. It's goddamn witch. Yeah, it serves you right, bro. Fuck you. You got off easy if you ask me. What the hell do you know? Working for c second like being a Marine. People get pissed off if we shoot somebody. Investigations, inquiries, rules, regulations. Every day I plow through enough red tape to choke a rhino. That's how you gotta be to do this job. So don't talk to me about right and wrong. You soldiers got it easy. I'm out of here. And good go. I'll blow your head off. I'll blow your head off right now. Where's your gun away, bro? Arkin sucks. It's a shame that motherfucker got a movie theater now. Hold on. Let me see what's in my codex. The, the Krogan oh, here we go. In a here we go, Dylan. Environment. Until the invention of gunpowder weapons, eaten by predators was still the number one cause of Krogan fatalities. Afterwards, it was death by gunshot. When the Salarians discovered them, the Krogan were a brutal, primitive species, struggling to survive a self-inflicted nuclear winter. The Salarians culturally uplifted them, teaching them to use and build modern technology so they could serve as soldiers in the Rachni War. Liberated from the harsh conditions of their homeworld, the quick-breeding Krogan experienced an unprecedented population explosion. They began to colonize nearby the worlds. quick breeding Krogan Even though these worlds were already inhabited. The Krogan rebellions lasted nearly a century 
only ending when the Turians unleashed the Genophage, a Salarian developed bioweapon that crushed all Krogan resistance. Oh, gosh. The Genophage makes only one in a thousand pregnancies viable. And today, the Krogan are a slowly dying breed. Understandably, the Krogan harbor a grudge against all other species, especially the Turians. Oh, nah, bro. Nah, bro. Nah, bro. We, yo, the Krogan, the Krogan's needed. The Krogan's need respect on all fronts, bro. The Krogan. If I if I was a Krogan, I'd be pissed too, bro. Like y'all not gonna do my people like that to where we can't even have children. One in every thousand is a freaking. Hold on, freestyle. I got you. Oh. Where the stereo at? Okay. Hey. Hey. Shake, 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 shake. You gonna shake that ass. You gonna shake that ass. You gonna shake them tits. Go ahead and shake that dick. Shake. You gotta shake it off. Shake it till it fall. Shake it on the wall. Uh, shake it on the ground. Shake it all around. Shake it in the chat. Maybe break that back. You look good. You look good. You look good. You look good. You look great. I want to take you on a date. Oh, you a sorry? Nah, you a hottie. You got a body. That's all I got. That's all I got. Until I drop the tape. Until I drop the tape. Like, just um, just just know I got some fire coming, bro. I'm gonna drop. I'm gonna drop uh, an entire album and it ain't got nothing to do about being lit, bro. Like, it's just me expressing myself in every song. Every song, bro. Got a message, bro. Yes, sir, bro. That one's that one. That one is just about, like, just, just being you and, and living life and just shaking, bro. I got business here, but not with you. All right, so I think the first thing that we got to do, bro. Sorry, I'll get to you when I can. Baby, you're not even working right now, sweetheart. Let me take a seat. I'm sorry, my name is... I just scared her. I gotta go, I gotta go, I gotta go, so she don't remember my face. Why didn't Captain Anderson tell us he used to be a specter? Maybe it's not true. Hawkins in the <laughs> Y'all said, Johnny Ghost, do your thing. Johnny Ghost, get a hold of that, bro. A million views uh by by um uh, tuesday all right so let me check my journal actually because go okay so go garris went to the med clinic in the upper wards to follow up a lead on Saren. nothing changed there nothing changed there all right so the med clinic Is this the med clinic, bro? Yes, uh, no, it's not. Maybe pointing your gun around the club is a bad look for humans. You think they care about stuff like that in Mass Effect 3, bro? Is that a bad habit that I'm developing? Doing this. <laughs> Do the grenades regenerate too? Or that's just uh Yo Berlin, go to the other side of the lake you were at to get to go get a side quest. Okay, so this is Chara's Den. Alright, alright. That's Chara's Den, right? Cora's Den, sorry. Uh lower markets, and we're trying to get to the med base. So I'm gonna go up here. I think I know what, what lake you're talking about, but that's like back in the Citadel Tower, isn't it? Shake that dick is crazy, yo, but everybody got to shake it, bro. Bro, everybody got to get to shaking, bro. I'm shaking mine. You're shaking more than twice, you're playing with it. Bro, I'm shaking mine, bro. 
that song come on, if that song come on, I'm doing this. Y'all almost got me. Y'all almost got me, bro. Y'all almost got me, bro. Y'all almost got me, bro. Almost lost everything, bro. Commander Shepard? Excuse me, Commander Shepard. I'm Emily Wong. I'm an investigative journalist working here on the Citadel. Could I have a moment of your time? Is this a side quest you're talking about, bro? Investigative journalist? They about to write a hit piece on me, bro. I gotta handle this. I gotta handle this like a P would, bro. What do you need? I've been hunting for evidence of corruption and organized crime on the Citadel, but there are places I can't go. Keep it P. Keep it P. I was P. hoping you might share anything you find during your own investigation. I can make it worth your time. Where is your character's eyebrows? Oh my gosh, bro. How many times they're there, bro? You can clearly see that they're actually there. Nah, bro. You're not getting off the hook that, that easy, bro. Nope. You're gonna have to answer for this one, bro. Ugh, Audie said that piece shit corny. I'm gonna have to keep it nifty. Bro. What, Brock? Why does your character look like that? <laughs> why does he? <laughs> he look bro, cool to me, bro. Why does your character look like that, bro? He looks, he looks very cool to me, bro. Actually, I will probably trust it with my life, bro. <laughs> bro, bro, I promise I you, know, bro. Because that, your character doesn't trust uh, nah, bro. with his life either. I promise you, bro. If it was, if it was him or you, you walking in with all that long ass hair, bro. You ain't trusted. I ain't trusting you with, <laughs> bro. I'm trusting you with, with beats. <laughs> Producers and lyrics, bro. I'm trusting him with my life, bro. Bro, I'm not trusting him with a with a shaver, electric shaver, nothing. Bro. Okay, and get left Boy, on Earth, bro. And, and, and get left on Earth, bro, because he he's actually Commander Shepard, leader of the Normandy, bro. Who actually is sir is. I don't know what any of that means, bro. Exact, exactly, bro. Hey, bro, st stick to beats and rap music, bro. And shoes, bro. And and StockX.com, bro. And don't call my phone anymore. Click. Got him. Got him. Got him. I was hoping you might share any. I can't tell who y'all W's is for right now, bro. You heard him hang up. No, you didn't, bro. Danielle came back. Okay, we got an answer. Danielle with the dono. Thank you so much, Danielle. She says, Saren actually just hit me up after my first dono. I'm actually on FaceTime with him right now. And somehow he heard you talking about me being interested in other creatures. And he said, you need to respect our relationship and not ask me about that. You've got to have access to better sources. Why contact me? I'm using every source I can find, but I think I've got a better shot with you. Hold on, According Emily. Did y'all catch that? You survived back on a cruise when everyone else in your squad got killed. If anyone can find the worst elements of the Citadel and live to tell about it, it's you. What is she asking me to do? Sounds like a good cause. If I find any information, it's yours. Thank you, Commander. You won't regret it. Okay, so we got our first side quest. What do I what do I what do I take the information to? Let me check my journal real quick, bro. A reporter named Emily Wong has asked you for help uncovering corruption on the Citadel. As you investigate the Citadel, be on the lookout for information that might help Miss Wong. I feel like I just got some, no? Oh, I, I leveled up, y'all. Oh, let's go, bro. When can I get my pist my shotgun? Oh, because of my choices in the beginning, I can only level up certain stuff. Oh, we gotta max out that charm then. Um Okay, this is making sense now, bro. Warp projects a powerful mass effect field that wrecks havoc on a subatomic level, weakens armor and inflicts dent and inflicts damage over time on enemies caught in the area. What does this one do? Increases warp's duration to 10 seconds. So I could probably throw somebody while they're laying down. I warp them, drain their shields. As they're standing up, I light them up with a pistol or a shotgun. I mean, a pistol, a pistol. Let me increase that throw. And then... Adrenaline boost. I'm gonna go here with assault training. 
I hate you, Caden. I don't even care what you do. Hold on, hold on. If you got powers, we might be able to use those. Let me let me check you out. So you have a throw, like me, a barrier. Bolsters your shield with a bar with a biotic barrier that will absorb up to 400 points of damage. Can use decryption skill on easy objects. Increases tech explosion. Bro, you're weak, bro. Restore a portion of your shields even while you are under fire. Recharge all talents so they can be used immediately. Which one is that under? All right, where is the med bay though? I mean, let, me, let me observe. Let me observe this scenic view real quick. This guy, bro. Is that your professional opinion? Man, he sucks, bro. He's right, Chief. Don't ever agree with Caden, sir. This isn't a station. It's a city. There must be millions here. It can't be possible to track everyone coming and going. This makes Jump Zero look like a portage on, and it's the largest deep space station the Alliance has. Jump Zero is big. But this is a whole nother scale. Look at the ward arms. How do they keep all that mass from flying apart? Big club, why keep humans out? Great question. No wonder the council treats us like outsiders. We'd be just another drop in a bucket they already can't carry. Mm. They must figure us for one more gang of FNGs looking for a handout. I doubt it's personal. It's gotta be a balancing act, like every other government. FN... Bro, Dante got a shout out in this game, bro. Big FNG, y'all. Shout out FNG in the chat. I gotta go to my codex and see what they mean, but that's ah. fire, bro. Where the FNG, bro? FNG, shut, bro. I doubt it's personal. It's gotta, it's got to be a balancing act like every other government. Why not? We've got oceans, beautiful women, this emotion called love. According to the old vids, we have everything they want. If you expect to get me in a tinfoil miniskirt and thigh-high boots, I want dinner first. I wasn't even talking about her. Sir. That Ooh. will be enough, Chief. Whoa! You see, the lack of eyebrows ain't stop nothing over on this side. Ain't stop nothing over on this side. She, bro, 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 bro. It's all right. It's all right. At ease, Lieutenant. Can't see her in a skirt anyway. Damn straight, you can't. Ready to move out, sir. Hold on, come on. Let me talk to you. Let me talk to you. Don't run. Don't run. Don't run. Don't run. At ease, Captain. At ease, Captain. At ease. At ease, Captain. All right. All right. All right. We in public, we in public. She respected me as a commander. What you mean I sold? What should I have said right there? Bro, bro, I'll be creepy in front of y'all, bro. I'm not finna be creepy like, like, like to her publicly, bro. But, but y'all, but y'all gotta know how I feel about it still. Like, uh, like otherwise, like, like what, what are we doing here, bro? If I can't be I my- I didn't tell anyone, I swear. That was smart, Doug. Now, if Garrus comes around, you stay smart. Keep your mouth shut or we'll... Who are you? Let her go. I'm about to throw him through the fucking... Ah! Nice shot, Garrus. Yo, Caden, consider your contract terminated, boy. Bro, bro throw him. I missed. I missed my throw, y'all. No, 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 no. We use, we use pistols over here. We use pistols. We use pistols. We use pistols. Someone give me a hand. Get your... oh. bro, I'm about to die, bro. Why do I suck at this game, man? Get cover. Get cover. Get get get, get pop. Get pop. Get pop. Oh, oh, oh! You thought you was doing something? You thought you was doing something? Get warped on. Get warped on. Oh my gosh, bro! Great teamwork. Great teamwork. I contributed, right? Heal up. How dare y'all? We're done. We're, we're good, right? Please, All clear. 
Wait, what happened to the lady? Did she... Did the lady die? Oh, there she goes. She cool. Perfect timing, Shepard. Gave me a clear shot at that bastard. Nice shot. You took him down clean. Sometimes you get lucky. Dr. Michelle, are you hurt? No, I'm okay. Thanks to you. All of you. I can't make no promises like that. Why were they threatening you? Who do they work for? They work for Feast. They wanted to shut me up, keep me from telling Garrus about the Quarian. Okay, they were, uh, <clears throat> tell me about the man. They work for Fist. They wanted to shut me up, keep me from telling Garrus about the Aquarian. Aquarian? What Quarian? Aquarian. A few days ago, a Quarian came by my office. She'd been shot, but she wouldn't tell me who did it. I could tell she was scared, probably on the run. She asked me about the Shadow Broker. She wanted to trade information in exchange for a safe place to hide. Where is she now? I put her in contact with Fist. He's an agent for the Shadow Broker. Not anymore. Now he works for Saren. And the Shadow Broker isn't too happy about it. Fist betrayed the Shadow Broker? That's stupid even for him. Saren must have made him quite the offer. The Quarian must have something Saren wants. Something worth crossing the Shadow Broker to get. What else can you tell me about the Quarian? I'm not sure. Like I said, she wanted to trade information for a place to hide. She didn't... Wait a minute. Geth. Her information had something to do with the Geth. She must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There is no way the Council can ignore this. But Fist has her on. Time we paid Fist a visit. This is your show, Shepard. But I want to bring Saren down as much as you do. I'm coming with you. Let's go! Why do you hate Saren, though? You're a Turian. Why do you want to bring him down? I couldn't find the proof I needed in my investigation, but I knew what was really going on. Saren is a traitor to the Council and a disgrace to my people. You made your case, bro. No, okay. Let's just say okay, bro. Welcome aboard, Garrus. Absolutely. You know, we aren't the only ones going after Fist. The Shadow Broker hired a Krogan bounty hunter named Rex to take him out. Big Rex. Yeah, we saw him in the bar. A Krogan might come in handy. Last I heard, he was at the CSEC Academy. What's he doing there? Replacing Fist you? Fist accused him of making threats. We brought Rex in for a little talk. If you hurry, you can catch him at the Academy before he leaves. Move out. Why would they show me all possible people already, bro? So there's literally only three more people I can choose? Why would they... Oh my gosh. All right, bro. I kind of took the smoke out of this whole operation, but it's all good, bro. I mean, for, for our first one out the gate, I'm having a blast, bro. What year did this come out, actually? 2007. Impressive. Mass Effect 4? There's currently no official release date for Mass Effect 4. However, we expect that the game will be coming either late 2023 or 20, 2024. By Ashley, by Caden. Ashley is a racist and Caden is a cornball. Ashley hasn't said anything that would make her that, bro. Why y'all hating on Ashley? Yo, Raina, this game is fire. Ashley better in combat with the trash personality. Ashley a pick me, but Caden annoying. Bro, Caden, Caden can, can piss off, bro. I don't care nothing about his bio, biotech powers, bro. I'm a vanguard. I'll cover for both of us. All right, let me check my journal real quick, bro. Oh, we, oh, we can level him up. I'm gonna let him, I'm gonna let him decide, bro. You are your own person. Allows long bursts of assault rifle without overheating. Okay, we love that for you, bro. Shield burst, a shield boost, I mean. Increases the amount of Omni Gel recovered. Let's you use the decryption skill to open secure objects. Grants the sabotage ability, which shuts down, which shuts down. Where's that at? Nice. Which shuts down enemy weapons within a certain radius. Bro. Fist, a crime lord hiding out at a bar called Chora's Den in the Lower Wars, is meeting with a Corian who has proof Saren is working with the Geth. Rex, the Krogan bounty hunter, is being questioned at the CSEC Academy. You can meet him there if you want to speak with him. Hold on, hold on. I, I'm, I'm really trying to understand this along the way, bro. 
He's been saying xenophobic stuff the entire game. <laughs> oh my gosh, bro. Justice for Ashley, bro. I don't recall. But I'd hate to be a pick me too. Here we go. Driven from their home system by the Geth nearly three centuries ago, most Quarians now live aboard the migrant fleet. Oh, these are the Quarians. A flotilla of 50,000 vessels ranging in size from passenger shuttles to mobile space stations. Home to 17 million Quarians, the flotilla understandably has scarce resources. Because of this, each Quarian must go on a rite of passage known as the pilgrimage when they come of age. 17 they leave million. The fleet and only return once they have found something of value they can bring back to their people. Other species tend to look down on the Quarians for creating the Geth and for the negative impact oh. their fleet has when it enters a system. This has led to many myths and rumors about the Quarians, including the belief that underneath their clothes and breathing masks, they are actually cybernetic creatures, a combination ah. of organic and synthetic parts. Ah. The Geth. Did this start as like a comic originally or did somebody like they literally just dropped this game and was like have fun i mean maybe i'm giving them too much credit bro there's only like what four races the one two three four Driven and then you got the five oh, okay the I'm are a humanoid race of no nope, started AIs. as this game it is getting they turned into a show though three. oh wow bro gaming is the leading industry of entertainment bro and it will only get bigger It'll only get better bro I feel like I've got maybe like 5% of the game done. Um, okay, so we need to go back to back to Korra's den. I'm gonna just take the, the car there. Hold on, okay, so we found Garrus. He was protecting the, med the medical staff lady. Medical staff lady, she was approached by by a what i'm really trying to understand all this y'all i'm sorry Look. by uh, she was approached by a quarian who wanted to exchange information for a place to hide because she was on her way to talk to talk to fist about something related to geth the information she had had to do with the geth and she's going to talk to fist who is working with siren who the the shadow broker has an issue with so the shadow broker is essentially a good person we don't know if, if the shadow broker takes sides but they are clearly not f with Saren. okay got it cool got it cool got it and if i don't got it bro y'all y'all help me out uh yo cj 2ksc thank you for the gift of sub kato to god my boy kato back bro why you do look like the Mike Lowry knockoff? Bro, don't do my mans like that, bro. But he definitely does. Mike Lowry Sr. Why is there why is there music heating up like this? Look out! I knew it. That actually scared me, bro. Ain't no way, bro. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Bro. No, no, no. Map throw. I fed up. Throwing nothing. Bro. Okay, three throw. Okay, so let, let, there we go. Let's, let, let's map warp. Get a flank, get a flank, get a flank, get a flank. Y'all. Curse of the Brows, Manny Matt says. This game is like 20, 30 hours, bro. At what hour are we going to leave him alone? Oh, see, I could have just looked on my mini map. All right, all right. All right, ask commander, I'll take point. Go there, Garrus. Garrus, go there, bro. Yep, get sat down. All right, map your throw. My throw was already mapped. Perfect, perfect. Yep, get sat down, get sat down. Get there, get there, get there. Take cover, take cover. Is that Rex, big ass? That's the bouncer. Oh, oh. Yep, 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 yep. I play Halo, bitch. I know how to straighten, bitch. I know how to straighten. I know how to straighten. 
strafe. Get that down. E eat one of your health. Nice, 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 nice. What's my grenade again? I just switched. Oh my gosh. What am I doing wrong here? I look in the chat. Ashley got folded. Why are you so happy about that, Simone? How do you throw grenades again? I think it's X, right? Let me just, let me just see. That was my last one. Let's go ahead and load that up one more time. Watch how I play this one. So, so watch how I play this one, bro. Y'all gonna be like, wow, he really do this now. Watch this. I walk in, immediately throw grenades. He didn't die from that. That's crazy though. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Nope, nope, nope. I'm a pistol master. I'm a pistol master. Yo, squad, squad, squad. Y'all head over there, bro. Bro, take point over there. Yep, 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 yep. We meet in the middle. We meet in the middle. We meet in the middle. Yep, I'm on you. I'm on you. I'm on you. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. All y'all get thrown across the fucking hallway, bro. Yep, 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 yep. Right here on you. Right here on you. Right here on you. Yep. Nope, 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 nope. You messing with a real, with a real, with a real, with a real nifty individual, bitch. Nope, 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 nope. Jaeger, like, why am I getting floored like this? Every time I get shot, he, he bends like that. Oh, Roger, you. You a whole Saren in the chat, bro. You a whole Saren in the chat, bro. Fist knows we're coming. If, if Karen is somebody who, who always reports to the authorities, you a Saren, bro. Traitor, bro. Sat down. Is he still awake? Oh, no, he's not. That runs up behind? It is him, bro. Let's get that down. What's up there? What what are y'all shooting at, bro? Bro, go go around. Go around. Yep, Ashley, yep, make it do what it do. Make it do what it do. Sat down, big boy. Yep, 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 yep. You know what? You know what? Get get hit. Get hit. Get hit with a warp next. Oh my god. Oh my god. Watch my back. Watch it's always him. Nice, nice. Ashley, you too, bro. You putting a little too much dip on it, chip. Get in, yo, Garris, Garris. You too far back, brother. Get up in the mix, bro. There you go. Yep, 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 yep. yep. Push up, push up, push up, push up, push up. Finish the job. Finish the job. Get sat down. Oh my gosh, bro. Oh my gosh, bro. Y'all doing all this for a dude named Fist, bro. Couldn't be me. Couldn't be me. Like, like, like he'd have to have, at least have a last name. Fist Jackson or something, bro. Fist? You almost died, wor worker, sir. Stop right there. Don't come any closer. Warehouse workers. All the real guards must be dead. Stay back or we'll shoot. This is, this is my charisma. This is my charisma right here. This is my charisma. This would be a good time to find somewhere else to work. Yeah, yeah, right. That's a good idea. Yeah, I never liked Fist anyway. <laughs> bro, people be so fickle, bro. I would have never thought of that. Shooting people isn't always the answer. That's why you can't lead with, with fear and violence, bro. You got to lead with love, bro. Because if they really cared about Fist, bro, they wouldn't have, they wouldn't have spoke to me. They would have said, and, and shot at me, bro. Knowing damn well they would have missed. Like me and Fallout earlier. We're not going to talk about that anymore. Let's go ahead and take all. Garris, get, get your... Bro. Oh, it's supposed to go this way. My fault. Is that Jamie Foxx in the game? Is Jamie Foxx... Why do I have to do everything myself? Bro, 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 bro. bro. So he, he's off rip going straight for the... Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yo, 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 get covered, get covered, get covered, get covered, get covered. Bro, get covered. That's it. Got him, got him, sat his dumb ass down. Don't kill me, I surrender. Where's the quarry? Oh my gosh, vicious. She's not here, I don't know where she is, that's the truth. He's lying. Nobody lies to me, Fist. You've got three seconds to come clean. 
Then I start shooting. The Quarian isn't here. Said you'd only deal with the Shadow Broker himself. Impossible. The Shadow Broker only works through his agents. Nobody meets the Shadow Broker. Ever. Even I don't know his true identity. But she didn't know that. I told her I'd set a meeting up. But when she shows up, it'll be Saren's men waiting for her. Are you son of a bitch? Tell me where that meeting is before I blow your lying head off. Here on the wards, the back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet them right now. You can make it if you hurry. Am I supposed to just forget your part in all this? Hey, I came clean. I told you about the meeting. Besides, I've got my own problems now. The Shadow Broker wants me dead. I have to disappear. Forget about me. I'm a ghost. You're not my concern. Don't worry, you'll never see me again. Okay, I probably could have killed him and got some decent loot, bro. I know they always give up the easiest bosses like that don't matter to the story in the beginning. He probably had a key to like some cool ass. <coughs> probably was with some lame ass. <coughs> okay. I'll take those, thank you. My backpack is, is infinite storage. Like I can just get however much I want. A lot of traffic here. How fast do you think those cars are going? Ashley, stay off, stay focused, sweetheart. If you feel lucky, we should visit the casino. This nigga trying to make bands, bro. <laughs> but it's just not right now. This old Republic Berlin lo loot they ass. <laughs> oh. <laughs> bro, somebody take point up there, man. Low key, bro. Tell me about these again. Um, allows long bursts of assault rifle without overheating. Restores a portion of your shields even when you're under fire. Overheats nearby enemy. Yeah, I need something that's gonna help me. Uh, recharges all talents. Nope. Restores a portion of your shields. Nope. All right, so you get busy, and I'm going to. Uh, what does this do? Oh, increases pistol damage. Yeah, use more. Yeah, we can set down. Fire in the hole. Grenaded bit. Just like that, we out of here. We out of here. We out of here. Imagine you're an alien and you hate humans, and then the one human that y'all want to bring onto the council does all this shit, bro. Like, you're yeah, not really helping your case, Loki, but I'll turn a blind eye, bro. Query and lock. Oh, oh, wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Where do we go? Where do we go? I did not see that. You have to get to the alley before they kill her. Is that on my mini map? Oh, it's right here. Perfect. Perfect. I'm in there. Did you bring it? Where's the shadow broker? Where's Fist? They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. The deal's off. Take cover. Good move. Good move. Good move. Markman, you dumbass. Use Markman. Oh, you're bogus, bro. All right, everybody turn up. Like, my guns are frozen. Just set me up. I knew I couldn't trust him. Don't worry about Fist. He got what was coming to him. Then I guess there are two things I need to thank you for. Who are you? Um, I'm a friend. My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence to prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving my life. 
But not here. We need to go somewhere safe. The ambassador's office. It's safe there. He'll want to see this anyway. Yo, chill, so chill, think. Hold on, bro. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards, an all-out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many... Who's this? The Quarian? What are you up to, Shepard? Right? Shut up and I'll tell you, bro. This Quarian can help us bring down Saren. I would have told you that if you hadn't jumped down my throat. I apologize, Commander. This whole thing with Saren has me a bit on edge. Show some respect. Maybe we should just start at the beginning, Miss... My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. We don't see many Quarians here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage. My rite of passage into adulthood. See, we knew that because we read our codexes. You know what I mean? I've never heard of this before. It is a tradition among my people. When we reach maturity, we leave the ships of our parents and our people behind. Alone, we search the stars, only returning to the flotilla once we have discovered something of value. In this way, we prove ourselves worthy of adulthood. What kinds of things do you look for? She... It could be resources like food or fuel, or some type of useful technology, or even knowledge that will make life easier on the flotilla. Through our pilgrimage, we prove that we will contribute to the community, rather than being a burden on our limited resources. Damn. I mean, I kind of feel that. I kind of feel that. But it's like... Bro, you didn't choose to be brought into this world, bro. It's like, damn, you born to prove yourself? Like, you can't just live life, bro? Uh, yo, Trill so chill. Thank you so much for the dono, bro. He says, bro, when I read Space Training in the title, it made the overly emotional and impactful relationship drama just a little bit unexpected. <laughs> nah, low key, bro. This this is like I feel like I feel like you can't avoid this, bro. You, you can't avoid it, bro. But thank you for the dono. You know, hey, this is simulator in all aspects, bro. You might run across the baddest alien on the planet. On multiple planets. What you gonna do, bro? Her scar her scarf cute as f you know I I definitely bag her over Ashley bro. Is that her name? Amanda? I think it's Ashley, right? Ashley Ashley um Thompson? I'm fucking with Tally Zora and Aurea, bro. But like this this you know what I'm saying? Like 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 she she cool, bro. And like like she got me feeling this way with no face. So like imagine if she had a face on her, bro. Like game over, man. Um Tell us what you found. During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, the Geth have never ventured beyond the Vale. I was curious. I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. Okay. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. Nice, nice. Who told you to do that, though? I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. I thought you said you would tell me the truth, <laughs> Chas. You're a whole specter out here. How did you manage to preserve the memory core? My people created the Geth. If you're quick, careful, and lucky, small caches of data can sometimes be saved. Most of the core was wiped clean, but I salvaged something from its audio banks. Oh, play that, play that, yep. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. Oh my gosh, we about to really ruin his life, bro. I love this for him. He said Eden Prime brought him one step closer to finding the conduit. Any idea what that means? The conduit must have something to do with the beacon. Maybe it's some kind of Prothean technology. Like a weapon. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Or should be Caden. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. Oh, that's the matriarch. We already seen her, bro. Like I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. Are they some kind of new alien species? According to the Memory Core, the Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. 
I mean, it's not far fetched, bro. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non organic life. And they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. This is a lot to handle. They might just ignore everything we tell them. No matter what they think about the rest of this, those audio files prove Saren's a traitor. The Captain's right. We need to present this to the Council right away. What about her, the Quarian? My name is Tali. Oh! You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me come with you. Absolutely. I'll take all the help I can get. Thanks. You won't regret this. Anderson and I will go ahead <laughs> ready with the council. Let's go. Take a few minutes to collect yourself. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh wee! Oh wee! Low key? I mean her comp bro, she might be she might be keeping me alive, low key. Is Tally and Ashley? Tally and Ashley? What y'all thinking, bro? Ashley getting jealous? Are they gonna have beef? Bro, I don't know. I don't know. Oh my gosh, bro. Oh my gosh, bro. So much empty space. A thousand of my people could live here and hardly even see each other. Um. Look at Ashley turning her back to us, bro. Give me a break. Give me a break. She gonna act like that, bro. Recover weapon upgrade. How do I upgrade it? Um, let me see. They could definitely use these. Now I'm gonna just turn the rest of these into gel. I don't even use shotguns. Low key, I need the pistol upgraded. And you can't. Yeah, you are you are you are our combat specialist, so you go ahead and equip that. Lokita, let me make sure she's good. Alright. Um you saved the core unit, she gave you evidence linking Saren to Geth. Ambassador Udina is going to present this evidence to the council. You should be there when the ambassador presents the Quarian's evidence to the council citadel. Return to the citadel tower in the Presidium. Let's go get Rex real quick and then we'll continue. A Krogan bouncer honey named Erd Erdnot Rex might be able to help you against Saren. What did I miss here? Fist. Oh, oh, that's what it is. All right. Cool, 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 cool. Actually, you'll be all right, bro. She's part of the squad. Tossie, you don't mind her, bro. Yo, I mean, I mean, Tali, Tali, excuse me. How you doing, Queen? You looking kind of great, delicious. I mean, smooth, 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 smooth. She's smooth. She's smooth. She's smooth. Excuse me, Commander Shepard. Could you spare a moment of your time? Damn, bro. Bro, what the fuck do you want, sir? Commander Shepard. My name is Samesh Bhatia. Forgive the intrusion, but I have nowhere else to turn. I'm listening. What do you need? My wife was a Marine. She was in the 212 on Eden Prime. Wait, the 212? Your wife was serviceman Narali Bhatia. I'm Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams. I served in her unit. Chief Williams, it is a pleasure. Nirali spoke of you with great respect. I'm so sorry for your loss, Mr. Bhatia. Narali was a good woman. What can we do for you? I've requested that my wife's body be returned to me for cremation, but the military has refused my request. Why did they refuse your request? There's got to be some reason. I don't know. All I know is that they have declared it impossible for my wife to be returned to me. Bro, can we get some leads? There's no reason for your wife's body to be held like this. Just wait here. The man in charge of my case is Mr. Bosker. When I last saw him, he was in the expensive bar over there. Thank you for your time. I just want to give my wife a proper funeral and the respect she deserves. No, absolutely, bro. Absolutely, bro. That's not cool that they would do that to you. Which bar is it? Matter of fact, I'm going to go weapons drawn. Which bar is it? Y'all drinking in here? Are y'all drinking in here? Are y'all drinking in here? Look at this here, bro. Elcor diplomat. You look like a baked potato, sir. 
human delighted welcome. I'm sorry, sir. Me. It's good to meet you too, my boy. Yeah. You a whole Russell. <laughs> I'm in the wrong part, bro. Bro, do y'all be cooking, bro? Y'all be making Russell potatoes, bro? Like, do y'all, do y'all? Y'all don't. Some mash by, oh, some mash is over there. Okay. There's no way to track quests on this game. That's one thing that I noticed too. Speak to Bosker, the diplomat handling Mr. Batia's situation and find out why his wife's body. He's in the embassy lounge on the Presidium. Bosker. Bosker has to be in this room. He pointed right over here. What was the other door? Okay. Almost lost my girl. So this one over here. Executor Palin. I'm a, I'm gonna press him about the previous uh Citadel case in a second. Hold on, this might be I might be able to uh, send this to, to old girl. Following message was transmitted from an untraceable account to multiple recipients across the extranet. That's what they call in the internet now and whenever 200 years from now, the extranet. Uh, a few unders. Wait a minute. You've been selected to receive this transmission because of our shared plight. Few understand us. Few tolerate us. We must stand together. We must build our own new world. Come join us in the Hawking Eta cluster. Only as one body can we right the wrongs done to our kind. My fellow biotic? Nah, bro. Nah, bro. What the hell does that mean? Some sort of biotic commune. On the whole, it seems harmless, but something about the message is disturbing. I'll go there eventually, bro. I'll go there eventually, bro. What you want to do, Queen? What you want to do, baby? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. At ease. At ease. <laughs> At ease. Let me talk to you. I get it, Ashley here. I get it. I get it. I wouldn't want to talk to me in front of her either. She crazy. Commander Shepard, I didn't expect to see you here. Yeah! Did Ambassador Udina send No. I came on my own. I need information. You humans are always so curious. Always sticking your fingers into someone else's pie. Is that the right expression? Ah, uh, never mind. Forget I asked. So you hate us too. You needed, Commander? So you hate us too. Right, let's talk about that too, bro. That's not it's not nifty. I get the feeling you're not too fond of humans. No. Just don't trust your kind. Not yet. You humans are eager to take all the power you can get, and you're being given a lot. If the Council wants to make humanity their new favorite pet, that's their business. But I don't have to like it. Favorites? Favorites? The Council treats us like second class citizens. We have to fight for everything we get. Talk your shit. Good. Then fight for it. But don't expect the rest of us to just sit back and let you take it. I'm a busy man, Commander. Are we done here? I don't ever want to. I don't ever want to hear y'all talk about Edmund Shepard being a racist, bro. He's not a racist, bro. He's a species, bro. He's he's thinking of humanity first. What's crazy, bro? Give us two hundred years? Well, nah, bro. Because we all look, look, look. We all clearly don't agree on the way that the future is going to look, right? Some of us don't believe in aliens. Some of us think Mass Effect can be a reality for us, right? Some of us can see big space stations in the sky with several alien races mixed in, right? What's crazy about me saying Commander uh, uh, Shepard thinks about humans first, bro? Bro, that might, that, might be, that might be a slur in the future, bro. Defending yourself as a human could be a slur, bro. Ain't that a crazy thought, bro? Imagine that. Imagine aliens are real. Okay, if aliens are real, if aliens are real, Kiera the star, right? If aliens are real, then the idea of being specious is a reality. So how do you feel about this? Are you cool with the with executioner talking to him like this, bro? Or is he wrong? Cause me, the way I'm standing right now, bro. Yo, humans is up, bro. Yep. Hurry and pack. Yep. What you gonna do? Cancel me? Yeah. I'm here, bro. Yeah, I'm here, bro. Solarian K, bro. Solarian pack. What you gonna do? 
Art Pixel said, hold on, you could get canceled. You could get canceled. That's crazy, bro. Humans are low key trash. We got a traitor in the chat. Get her out of here, bro. We don't accept your kind, bro. Humans only, bro. <laughs> I would love to be shocked and there just be an alien invasion next year, bro. And then we're all just like, everything we believed in was a lie. They're actually here now. What do you think the criteria would be to stay alive during that? Like, do you think that you'd have to be a good person? Do you think that you'd have to be a certain type of look? Do you think the deeds that you've done throughout the course of your life will save you from an alien invasion? Shuri Witwicky said, I'm just, just die. Mm. Kiara said, but what if? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. That looks like it's gonna spawn a conversation. But what if we are just robots who are just becoming self-aware now? Damn. So technically we the geth. Technically we are the geth, bro. Bro, bro. I feel like if that were the case, then like, damn. Cause I was about to say right now, how do we explain memories and dreams? But like, what if, what if those are just downloaded too, bro? What if everything that we experienced was, was predestined, bro? Right? Right? And to have a dream is just to have a, a, a glitch in our hardware, bro. Whoa! Bro, I don't know, bro. I don't put anything past anything, man. But who's programming us? The government? I'm done talking, bro. I'm done talking, bro. Let's, uh, let's continue. What do you know about the specters? They're the right hand of the counselor, so they like to be called. More like the underhanded side of the council. Okay, so specters don't get all the unk, what do you get all the praise. The I can't abide any organization that considers itself above the law. Especially when it's left up to each individual specter to decide when and how to bend the rules. Sometimes you have to bend the law to keep people safe. I've been with CSEC for 30 years. I've never had to break the law to do my job, not once. Yeah, right. You expect us to believe none of your officers are corrupt? There are over 200,000 CSEC agents. Some of them are going to be bad. But we don't turn a blind eye to corruption like the Spectres do. We do our best to find and punish any officer who breaks the law. Spectres. <laughs> They'll never come under that kind of scrutiny. The galaxy needs people like that. People who do the dirty jobs. I agree. But they need to be held to a higher standard. They need to be accountable. Saren's out of control. We both know that. But because he's a specter, the Council doesn't want to do anything about it. Is that the kind of person this galaxy needs? But not all specters are like Saren. True. But the potential is always there. Tell me about your investigation into Saren. Sorry, Commander. I don't make a habit of giving out details about ongoing investigations. Got drink in my cup, pockets they fat, they eating they lunch, and I be in the parties only if it's popping. Top model copping, pop bottles often. That's no question, I'm turned up. Babysitting ass nigga, drink your cup. We party to the AM, hit the AM PM. Chicks stop and stare, cause the easy, we them. We in the party, she feeling naughty, she feeling on me. I think she want me, but I'm a Mac, never slipping on my pimping. Probably got your girl and she tipping on my dick, and if a nigga feeling froggy, man, fuck a tap. I wake up counting